Yo, what up, everybody? Happy Monday night. We are here Hola. for the finale. The finale of Life is Strange 2. Yes. Finally. Finally. Yeah. We are here. So, um, I'm looking forward to seeing how this ends. I want these boys to make it to Puerto Lobos. We chose violence at the end of last episode. Well, I chose violence. Shira doesn't want to get lumped into my... Uh, no, no. That's, that's not what I said. I chose violence against the woman. I just wanted us to shoot her with the bullet. Well, that's we had no control. We had I no know, control. I know. I'm just saying, had I had it... Why are you arguing? My way. I'm not arguing. You're getting nasty. I'm not getting nasty. I know. Run a poll on Twitch. Is Shira getting nasty with Roshi on stream? Yes or no? You but anyway, me? anyway, <laughs> but anyway, um, we um, we took Lizbeth out. She's dead. I am completely happy with my decision. No regrets. I I have zero regrets, regrets. whatsoever. So R A G R E T S. Exactly. Regrets. Um. Oh, Murhawk with the subs. Thank you, sir. Murhawk for the subs. Thank you, Murhawk, with the twenty gifted subs. Holy crap! Oh my god. Start. We, we we starting off big tonight, huh? So, um, yes, I see somebody. Somebody brought up Life is Strange True Colors. That's next week. We will be streaming streaming Life is Strange True Colors, and we will all be, you know, together experiencing this game together. Brand new experience. So uh, I'm not gonna hold you too long. We're gonna jump into episode five here. It's called Wolves. Let's see what we got, guys. Oh yes, and I I made sure not to forget to show y'all the gameplay. Cause yeah. That was a big L last time. Alright. Thank you for the sub, Jaximum. Really appreciate it. And Mars over on YouTube. I'm not sure. I'm not sure we're gonna play right after this. Like obviously we're gonna take a break a day or two. Whoa, Thallium with the gifted subs. Thank you. Y'all going absolutely ham tonight. Thank you. Shira with the, Shira with the gifted subs. Yeah, going absolutely time. ham. Thank you, MLG Beast, as well. Um, giving out gifts to the community. Hopefully my hopefully my hype meter actually works. Jesus, Shira, you know, 25? Damn. Yeah, you better put that back in my paycheck. Payroll. Yeah. <laughs> um... <laughs> Thank you for joining Barry. Thank you for the dono, Jakir. Going absolutely ham. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna jump into episode five, Wolves. Somebody said this episode is better than episode four, which I thought was fantastic. They should be giving us our little recap. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, Thanks for the dono. What's there were going two on wolf world? brothers living in their home lair. Yeah, do rag energy for tonight. You already know they what time it is. They lived in peace <laughs> until hunters took their you death. You already know what time it is. Thanks for the subs, kids. Days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. That's when the big brother. Thank you, Kitsune, for the subs. Was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. And sorry, we decided to head south for, uh, to the distant land. We're gonna get that working this week, y'all. I promise. But the journey Don't was long and dangerous. Oh, all right. <laughs> Still, the wolf brothers made new friends on the way. They learned more about the world, but danger. Seem to always follow them after a bad accident. They were separated. Thank you, Jenna. Thank you, Jenna. Your brother had been hurt. Oh, yeah, Jenna. And the hunters and the finally captured him. Thank you. Welcome to our Twitch. They put him in a cage. But when he finally escaped, he went to search for his little brother. I think it's messed up that they they would have allowed you to take out, out Joey. Thank you for the dono, Barry. Had joined a coyote cult. We appreciate and he would it. Not leave them. Suddenly. Their mother showed up after all. Oh, I mean, it's 
subs. She next said, up. "Let's go party with the gift of subs." Y'all blessing us tonight. Thank you so much, man. We the appreciate each and every one of you. Leader, Seriously, but she would not release the little wolf. He was their idol. So the little brother got so angry, he killed her. They just said the, the little brother got so angry, now angry they angry. killed her. Followed their rogue mother far into the desert to her hideaway. Uh oh. Mama Harbor and fugitives. Thanks for the dono, Barry. You love to see it. You love to see it. And this is this is how we do. If our daughters ever end up as fugitives, you don't turn them in. You harbor them as fugitives, and then we potentially get, go to jail as well. Vin Diesel would do it. You ride or die for family, Shira. Ride or yeah, die. Yeah, so what we could do is I'll get a separate apartment and you can stay in the house and harbor them. Yeah. <laughs> so that way I have plausible deniability. Oh, wow. Seven weeks. Seven weeks passed. Thanks for the don't know what's going on world. <laughs> Black Air Force energy and do rag. Everybody getting clapped. <laughs> Y'all have no idea, man. These people done sent me off the deep end. Are we sleeping outside? Family. Family. Hey, wake up, Sean. Mm. Dude, come on. What? What time is it? See the, hair, the hair growing it's back. So beautiful. Check it out. That is dope. Somebody said, I can't wait to see this train wreck. <laughs> Listen, man, y'all gotta have faith. Listen. <laughs> so? Yeah, okay. Good call. Wow. That's amazing. I know. Is your eye okay? Yeah. It just itches. It's okay, Nana. We didn't get... I we didn't bring the promise. antibiotics? I guess not. Yeah. Uh, okay. I love you. No matter what happens. You hear me? Yeah. I love you too. Wolf Brothers. <laughs> Diaz Brothers. Always. Yeah? From, from where? From where? That wouldn't even make sense. They said Diaz Brothers. <laughs> like, so... like, it was sweet. Are you still having you gotta, those bad dreams? Hey, look, the other two guys came out of nowhere you know, last time. About Lisbeth? They came out from in the middle no. of the desert. I guess... I don't feel that bad about what I did. Maybe... We don't feel bad at all. That's bad. We don't feel bad. Not in this case. It was her or us. You did what you had to do, Anano. I know. She was so nice at first. I can't believe she turned me against you. I'm sorry, Sean. <laughs> no way. We're the wolf bros. Because he got Nobody can issues. tear us apart. Nobody. That's why that happened. Right? Sean. Are we criminals now? <laughs> yes. Yeah, we've been criminals. Yes. We are legitimate. Sort of. <laughs> 
Yeah, we are legitimate. Sure. Not sort of. We're literal criminals. We did a lot of. He has to sugarcoat it for him. Illegal shit. <laughs> if the cops catch us. Yo, thank you for the donor reflex. We'll be judged for what we did. <laughs> Bigger allowance for the finale. That's for sure. Oh! I won't let them get us. Should have bought a wolf mask. Yeah. Well, we're almost at the border. Finally. I like it here, but we'll have to leave soon. What is there to like? I know. I'm Everything's sorry. Been going it's beautiful. He he likes oh, it where they the are. Scenery. Yeah. I know it's been a long time. Oh, Can you say. tell me the rest of the wolf story? It's not done yet. Yes. Oh. Thanks Thank you for, for the donut so far. Yeah. I can tell you. <sighs> been forever since we left off. Way too long. Hmm. Let's see. Oh yeah. Okay. So. You thanks to their mom wolf, look at how long the wolf there brothers is. barely escaped from the coyote cult. Yeah, so it's been seven weeks. Yeah. Well, she led them to her out. secret lair, deep in the red desert. They usually only give you enough for like two weeks. The wolf brothers rested for a while, but at some point, they'd have to continue their journey south. I real dad. They were closer than or ever to real their dad. father's land. But Real between dead. them, Real dad. the destination. <laughs> That's what it looked like for all of The here. evil chupacabra. And they would have to fight it together. Uh, um, excuse me. Who's telling the story? You are. But it's my story too. Right? <laughs> yeah. That's true. Okay then. So what happens next? Uh, okay. So the Wolf Brothers encounter the evil Chupacabra. And he attacks them. He's no way. very dangerous. But the little wolf uses his powers to crush him. They arrive in the magic land as heroes. That's right. We're heroes. Because they have defeated the beast. That's right. <laughs> okay, Stephen King Jr. You win. That wasn't even a horror Let's story. Let's pack this shit up and head back to town. Gotta clean up our stuff before we leave. This place is too pretty. I'm glad we had these. Not a fan of desert critters. Desert oh, critters. Time to look at our... Oh, let's draw the scenery. What you mean? We, not, we can't leave. Ooh, <laughs> sketching a time. A Good mask. idea. <laughs> A twerk in a wolf mask? Y'all are sick, I'm glad you bro. can still draw. <laughs> you know. You motherfuckers need Jesus. Oil for 800. <laughs> but if I can see it in my I mind, by far. I can still sketch anything. <laughs> Take the cake. Yeah, that took me out. Whoever said that. Almost. That's so cool. All right, calm down real dead. Calm I don't down. want you to stop drawing. Ever. <laughs> Thanks, man. This is so cool. Oh, so I can be sexualized on stream. Yes, you can. It's okay for people to just harass me hey. for my man cakes. Hey, can you draw me but as a superhero? It's okay for them to harass like me for my man. Striking mind. a pose over the canyon. Hmm. I can try. Badass. Let's do it. They say $800 for a wolf mask. <laughs> Oh, this is gonna be a sick picture. Look at this. My back hurts a little. He didn't deny or confirm. Tada! Finished. Let me check it out. <laughs> oh yeah! Now that's a badass superhero you don't want to mess with. That's dope. Wait, is this is this how that movie started? Like Brightburn? Is this the kid from Brightburn? Is that what I'm building right? Is that what I'm creating right now? Please let me know. Because then that might change. So things. incredible to see all those stars and planets up close. The chat's down there. It's like we're right there. <laughs> okay, we have to look at this book, Shira. Because we missed out on a lot of stuff. Look at all this. He <laughs> said $800 for wearing wolf mask while working, but oil up. <laughs> you niggas is disgusting, man. 
chat shares two brain cells. You can't. Is it two two thousand if he opens it up? <laughs> That's so gross. What the fuck is wrong with you people? Man? That's disgusting. <laughs> Hang on, chill. Karen wants to uh, talk. It's hard, but I'm trying to hear her out. Not sure I'll ever understand what she's been through, what she's after, but I can try. Wait, what is this? Oh, that's when we burn the shit down. We got Daniel back, but at what cost? What the hell happened? Why? Did she really have to die? Daniel the mythical beast. I'm getting the hell out of Haven Point now. Glad Karen is driving. We need to breathe, sleep, forget. What is that? Blah, 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 blah. What is, what is BL, 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 blah, 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 blah. Brazilian butt lift. That's BBL, Shira. I know. I was just being stupid. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what this is. Somebody fill me in on what 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 is blah 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 blah. Blah 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 Okay, nobody knows. Okay, a bunch of a bunch of. It's onomatopoeia. Okay. I don't know. That's onomatopoeia four, but Karen lives in a desert commune. It's the drowning oh, zones. Oh, okay. <laughs> the sound of them cheeks laughing. Okay. <laughs> I'm about to hide the chat for sure because she can't. She has no self control. I don't have self control. No, you don't. I don't. Okay. okay. Karen lives in a desert commune. No shit. Unincorporated community. She said it's called away. Only thirty people here live here on and off. This place is so weird. But the desert is mind blowing. Perfect hideaway. I mean, technically, it is a perfect hideaway. Daniel's still feeling so confused, guilt tripping a lot. He can't figure out what happened. The brainwashing, the lies, Elizabeth grapple, grasp over his trauma. Doing my best to help him recover. Sure hope they're fine. Sure hope they fine now. That's that's fucking weird. That's the first time that <laughs> that's the first time we be speaking like that. Karen is a big help too. She's good with words. The letter from Jacob and Sarah made him happy. Daniel needs more friends, and so do I. Sean, we posing. Yeah. What? What? It was N N N G H. Yeah. At the end, you didn't read that part. What are you fucking Rick Ross? Oh. No, I said yeah. And in song. Total trip to live with Karen again. She wants to move on. That's easy for her to say. I'm trying. Daniel's getting better. I can see he loves having mommy back. <laughs> Daniel's pop. <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> Your fans are. Can you read the chat when we're done with this, and then you can pop up? I off? literally looked down at something real quick, and when I looked down for something real quick, I saw the one <laughs> message in there that was probably the worst one. Daniel's power is no secret here. No one gives a shit. They just go along with it and don't see it as something they can use to their own advantage. It's refreshing. Groar. Why does he always put weird shit in the middle of these important notes? Who's gonna tell? We're Thanks already bashing crazy. Don't know reflex. People. Or will she get your chat under control? Listen. Okay. These are a bunch of grown people, I'm guessing. They like his they like his yams. So this place away is what you make it. Joan haunts it with cool ass sculptures made from scavenged scraps. She's cool and a sunny woman. Karen's closet. Closest thing to a best friend, it seems. Thank you, Rexo. <laughs> um Cool as heck ornamental tattoos. Take my time today. Oh, we're gonna meet these people this chapter. Arthur and Stanley live in one of the only proper houses in time they built in town. They built it together ten years ago from ruins of their past lives. These two can't stop. Thanks for each the other. dono. What's so going on, world? Next dance song is pop lock and drop it. Yeah, if you want the stream to disappear into the abyss, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> this place makes you want to draw because staircase forever. Daniel needs to vent out. He's been having nightmares about Haven Point and Elizabeth for weeks. Still feels guilty about my eye. I need to find ways to help him process this. Sorry, y'all. Oh, whoops. Okay. That's loud. Karen told us about a cool camping spot. Reached the top after a long hike across the canyon. Track sessions feel like forever ago. Need to work on my cardio. Don't fall, mate. Ursa Major. Man Horsarius. Probably the best view ever. Gonna stargaze all night thanks to Arthur's telescope. Daniel seems happy. And that's what I just drew. 
Every star looked the same. <laughs> until we used Karen's old guidebook. <laughs> You niggas are sick. Oh, you started it. It's so nice. I he swear, Dad, morning. at that same book in Dad, the garage. It gets so hot. Yeah, I think he did. Why did he never show it to us? Did I hear him talking Maybe twice? Yeah. <laughs> it reminded him of Mom too much. Oh. Yeah. Right. Hey, I can help. Just tell me what you want to put in there. You are the man. I hope we can go watch the stars again. Mom said there's a moon eclipse coming up soon. <laughs> I'm in. Yeah, we'll be able to watch the this stars. This place is cool. From our prison cell. I could just move here. I'm just kidding, because you're not going to jail. You're going right. to Puerto Lobos. Activate flashlight. On Would the way. Up? Oh. See Let's that clean up this mess. <laughs> Not if it huh? cleans up by itself. Switch y'all are a mess. Stop. Daniel. Can't catch it, huh? No Thanks shit. For the subs. Now cut it out. Jeez. Kiki. You're no fun. Yo, Captain Can, can you take these away? Sure. And no funny business. Of course not. Perfect formation. All right, now let's get on up out of here. Is that everything? Um, yeah, that's pretty much everything. All right, oh no, pack the sketchbook. Well, let's hit the trail, cowboy. I can't wait to meet these people this episode who are most likely gonna get fucked up somehow. What is that? You hear that? Yeah, it's like a swirling noise. Oh. What are you doing? I'm suffocating it. What the fuck, dude? Don't do that. What's wrong? Stop messing with it, man. What's the big deal? Look. I hope he's not listening to us. Seriously? What did you do that for? <sighs> Whatever. That thing could sting us to death. So what? You just torture it? <sighs> Jeez. Hey. I won't do it again. If okay. it matters to you. Okay. Let's just you know, it. at least he respects we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Sean's feelings. We'll see if that if that stays the case. Torturing bugs and insects and animals and stuff is like signs of a serious I wish we saw more falling stars. <laughs> exactly. We don't need to be or doing any. that. We just need to defend ourselves from Holy. Hey, we saw the Milky Way, dude. How cool is that? Yeah, that's true. And Mars. That was so cool. Arthur and Stanley let us use the telescope. Hurry up, because last yeah. time I left you, you got dirty. These guys are really cool. And then the cool. chat yelled at me. <laughs> weed, like smoking weed? Yeah, what just happened? I said this. Amazing that anything can grow out here. Does it ever rain in the desert? Well, oh, uh, good question. Didn't Joanne will let me help her with her sculpture when we get back? Oh, is dangerous. Like the magic Whoa, is thank you for it's yeah? nice to be able to use my power up here. <laughs> Not hide it. Yeah, I'm sure of being Karen generous right. to y'all tonight. They're all cool with it. Aggie. Mom doesn't say much about my power. But really, it's Roshi being Why do generous you think? to you because he's gonna put it back in my kitchen. No, I'm not. <laughs> She's um, confused. How do we get like, past this originally? What do you mean? She's my mom. Well, you know. I mean. She hasn't seen you for years. Not sure she can deal with all of this at the same time. Huh. It must Looks be like a job for our local super psychic boy. Lift that shit up, boy. So, maybe you can help us get out of here? Mm, I'll try. 
Step back. Be super careful. Murhawk. What the fuck are you in Murhawk in competition? No. I already beat him twice. <gasps> Boom. <laughs> Easy peasy. <laughs> nice man. I can already tell this episode is gonna be so messed up. Thank you, Murhawk. I'm literally getting the the vibes that this is gonna be messed up. Shira is pimping me out. What? I'm about to call an abuse hotline. How am I pimping you? That's out? what somebody said. You pimping me out. Thank you for I'm joining not, Equinox. Though. We appreciate it, entropy. Or int. What up, Equinox? CPY. Oh, this is a nice little quaint village here where nobody will ever find us, ever. Okay, cool. Roshi, we down bad. We need the cheeks. Y'all gotta stop. <laughs> you did it to yourself when someone wanted to speaking, see my melons and you made while speaking made it Japanese anime style. Yeah. That's disgusting. Just fucking twerking. Still be messing. <laughs> Speaking <laughs> Japanese. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna go see what Joanne is. Go for, for it. The donor reflex. I have to bring back the telescope to Stanley and Arthur. All right, time to meet Stanley and Arthur. Went to town they for weekly if supplies. If take deals Some for pancakes left in the kitchen. No. <laughs> back soon. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, you copy? Yes, I read you. Ten four. I have a pancake alert in the kitchen. Repeat. Pancake alert. Oh man. Sorry. I was gonna eat with Joanne. Over and out. Ten four. No flying pancakes today. That's literally not how you spell Joanne. That's fucking <laughs> Joan. Alright, all right, you little bitch. I eat by myself then. Fuck you too. Karen looks so young and fragile on this picture. Maggie and Karen, summer mm. of 2011 in Kissimmee. Right up yep. the street from us. Yep, right around the corner. They was right up there by Disney. <laughs> Karen doesn't even like to leave this place just to go shopping. Karen must have been so excited to finally hit New York. Fly by night, not by fright, into the big city bright. Stop. Thanks for the dono reflex. That cliche never dying in the steel of the buildings, the warp of the street. But no matter what Thanks or where I through. spin, the pull of a million dead poets takes me to dance once again. Go. But this time I get to lead until the next flight. I wasn't feeling that at all. Looks like they all finally found their home. Oh, look, there goes their mom right there. Mm -hmm. Wow, y'all all finna die in this episode, Heffa. huh? Thank you, Jakir, for the dono. Jacob's letter. I'm so glad Jacob and his sister are doing okay. They Hola, deserve Sean. some peace. Sorry I did not write to you sooner, but this was the first time I've had a chance to relax after we got out of Haven Point. Thanks to you and your brother. I still can't believe it really happened. So bizarre. Sarah Lee and I do miss our parents, but we're not ready to let them know where we are yet. We will figure it out later. Thanks to my old savings account, I finally got Sarah Lee's antibiotics, so she's feeling better pretty fast. Kids are like superhumans. Well, they could literally track you from your bank account. The most important thing to me is my sister, just like your brother. You were lucky to have each other, and when you both came our way, we were blessed. I'm trying to track down our Humboldt crew, so I'll keep you posted. I hope everybody's okay after that night on the farm. We all deserve a break and a better future. Please let me know when you make it to the other side. You and Daniel got this. Give our little hero a big hug. Yeah? When you make it to the other side? When we die? Yeah. Yeah? It's fucked up. No. Praying on our downfall. He's talking about Mexico. No, he's talking about death. No, he's not. Thank you for the dono, True Light. Neither Karen was desperate for a job. Would it or be bad to clap kids. Daniel asleep? Brooke could kill Sean because some other stranger he likes says so. Wow. Like, what almost happened? 
when he pushed us aside? Karen has been camping in her own house since we arrived. I still don't like Karen. Karen is not redeemed with me. Daniel's Big Ten late birthday party. Aww, she's trying. Made him feel so happy. Yeah, she's trying as she watched her son get mutilated in front of her. <laughs> well, listen, we got retribution for that. We she killed changed my diapers, but it feels kind of awkward to be here. She changed my diapers, but Karen kind of thick, bro. <sighs> Gotta keep my eye lube handy. Uh. See, Clyde, it's I not. It that's much. what I meant. That's what I meant to tell you. It's not like prescribed antibiotics. It's just bullshit they picked up at Walgreens. Uh, I wish Karen didn't tell me she got a rattlesnake out of the toilet last week. Mm -mm, that's scary. Fun fact: I remember I was watching this show when I was a little kid about this family that had like a, a big ass snake come through their toilet, and I was scared to shit for weeks. Even though I lived Dad in New was York. An absolute fan of this movie. Chupacabras from <laughs> Maybe they space. were nerds together. Um, let's look through Sean's tabs. Let's see what this kid looking at, bro. What you got going on on the computer, huh? Brody's so good at describing painful situations. Oh, nice. And seeing the good into it. I yeah. miss you too, sis. Oh, yeah, he'd be having his Hope we can take some new pictures someday. I just hope that we meet him up, meet up with him again. Yeah, probably not gonna happen. Lila Park going ham free the families my family look at that she's posting memes the little cat meme me during the day all good under control me at 3 a.m in my bed oh look she's saying our phrase yeah yeah <laughs> no she's not saying yeah it's ah it's just a listen you had to ruin it you had to ruin it okay you had to ruin it thinking of sean be seeing you again brother then we rage yeah after you call I wonder if us snitching Man. on Finn is going to come back to bite I'm us. still not used to this heat out here. I have a story of finding a giant water bug in a toilet paper roll in a public bathroom in middle school. That was like 15 years ago, and I still think about it. It's, yeah. it I have it, lots it of bug trauma. You. Yeah, I have lots of oh, bug sure. trauma. Oh, sure. Sure is so deathly afraid of bugs. It could be so the smallest thing, and then I'll be like across the house, and I hear... Karen <laughs> letting us invade her space. And I'm like, what is it? And she's like, a bug. I do remember Karen would drown her pancakes in hot sauce. Especially like Ugh, palmetto bugs gross. and like freaking spiders. One thing Claire and Karen have in common, their love for pancakes. Bro, who eats pancakes like that? He picked it up like a sandwich. Bro, you're, bro. I guess somebody who's hungry. You're the real villain of this story. That, that don't even make no sense. Whoa. Fuck. I hope Karen sends this to Claire and Steven. Hi, Mom and Dad. I've been thinking about this letter for a while, and I know it's been long, a long time coming. So I'm sitting here tonight thinking about the world, words I should have written 10 years ago. You used to always say everything happens for a reason. Oh, okay. The gray words. It's like he scratched stuff out. That's cool. That they, that, that's how they did that. Yeah. I understand why now. There is a reason I feel like I have to reach out to you both tonight from the desert i know you've only heard from you once by phone and six times by a letter for almost a decade i didn't mean to hurt you and i was certainly not trying to punish you don't laugh but i just didn't know what to say or write poets block just like how you had to block me from your life after i left esteban i understand that was how you had to deal with a problem child an only child who didn't live up to your expectations there's no denying i failed you but the weight of your aspirations as parents failed me too. You had such a rigid opinion of what I was supposed to be that it, I just didn't have the opportunity to explore who I actually was. You wanted a daughter to grow up happy, find a good job and a great husband, settle down <laughs> to breed, <laughs> have kids and raise them in faith to continue the cycle of suburbia. I, that daughter wasn't me. That's funny though. That, that even goes to show you her mentality. She considers like what she did just it's like speaking of herself like an animal. Like, oh, yeah, just settle down and breed. Like, she really doesn't give a fuck about these kids. As I said, y'all, she there's literally no redemption <laughs> for her. I know that you were me. raised in a different time and culture, so I didn't understand your point of view. Like, you didn't understand your wayward daughter. Maybe a bridge too far for us at the time. After Danny was born, you knew I wanted to take some time to figure things out in my head and heart. 
it didn't make sense to you or dad and i get that but i was so desperate and only esteban was willing to give me that time because he saw how unhappy i was i don't blame you for my decision to leave and maybe a timeout would have led to the same outcome we will never know and i try not to live in regret my life has been a roller coaster and there have been times i long to hear your voices and thoughts and i know when i last talked to you in new york to ask for help in paying back my debts you wanted to help but it was on your condition to return right back to where i couldn't return i hate that was our last conversation i'm sorry i reached out to you this day i'm sorry i broke your hearts i'm sorry i let you broke them i am sorry i let you broke mine okay that's fucking typo so long, yeah i think we paid our dues and now i sit under a blue field of crystal stars like the poet i hope i am writing and waiting for a chance to rebuild an old bridge with my mother and father i hope we can cross it one more time she scratched out love just your daughter this lady sucks so okay now now you knowing she's really good at rewriting her own life why she left like the reason behind it are you still in favor this of one's pretty intense i think i get it um voluntarily let them into her room to look through her stuff like now knowing that this is the reason that she left because now i kind of understand like okay why here's they my were like but here's my thing though i see both sides of it like i i don't feel like it was you know, it's fair, obviously, for the grandparents to force their ideologies on them, but it's almost kind of like a protection thing, too. Like, maybe they did, they thought it would hurt them more to know that, like, oh, your mom didn't leave for any plausible reason. She just left because well, she literally didn't want to well, be Well, no, the grandmother had the room locked. It wasn't to protect them. It was because they had their own personal beef with Karen. It wasn't anything to do with the kids. She just wasn't fucking with it. The father was... The father was the one that was like, like, I can't do this. Like he was just going along with what the mom wanted, but the mom was the one that had the real beef. <clears throat> but I still think, no, like let them know what the fuck's going on. But the, <clears throat> but the grandmother got like offended when they're like, oh, you think that she left, because, but you know nothing. They do, know, they did know nothing. Like it's a very complicated situation. Like me as a grandparent, I would feel conflicted to tell my grandbabies like yeah your mom just wasn't effing with it like she wasn't effing with the situation yeah but she never even sent the letter explaining herself that letter's just been sitting on her thing that's why but they know why she left <laughs> yeah but... So, but so that's what i'm saying like they they know why she left so that's why i you know i kind of bro look at her name those are red flags since she was birthed yeah <laughs> how ridiculous they gave her the perfect name but i'm just saying that like I, I I would feel conflicted as a no matter parent. what no matter what I'm not keeping no kid from knowing their parent that's not my place personally I feel that's literally not my place let's read this poem she wrote I am a solo Mobius trip just when I reach the end I go back to the beginning resign myself to new faces the privilege to escape and rewrite another draft goddess laughs at plans then shows me the page left unmarked for years out in the ghost desert, the seeds return as saplings to reveal their age and power. Now I go back forward, layer with fear and hope to water the children of the sun. She's fucking garbage at writing poems. What is this nigga talking about? Don't believe I would find a soul within or without a church. A miracle with sleep and food and fuck. <laughs> a day without shit. Until it was not. Now we run to celestial spires. Oh, visions of the fake prophet. Engulfed in ego and belief, as the burning cross falls on all your cruel angels, I am the bonfire of vanities. So when the dam breaks, we all flood like glass on a mirage, if I believe. Yeah. No. No! Look at that, they do their own gardening and shit? This is crazy. Discuss with who? He's not even here. <laughs> Arthur and Stan. Oh. Excuse me. Water boy. Did you remember to feed the crops? I never forget. Ask mom. But no way I can grow stuff like she can. What the fuck is wrong with y'all? <laughs> I had to stop to read this comment. It li this says, Roshi, put a dollop of whipped cream on your back and torque until it melts down to your cheek. <laughs> Mm. 
Y'all gotta stop, man. <laughs> Y'all gotta stop. What is, <laughs> what is going on? Oh, man. The bro. <laughs> bro. Yes. What the F? Who says dollop? <laughs> <laughs> well, I was thinking about to put a tuft of whipped cream on. <laughs> Maybe in Mexico. Hey, all oh yeah. Whip, whip, we can whip, grow a lot of stuff cheese. there. Sick. <laughs> nice mess. Oh look at him, he's getting uh, into art too. Never change. Well he's been into art. What am I talking about? Karen taught me some cool off the grid shit. Still can't believe she's kept it. Aww. It's nice to play games with Daniel again. But can you play spades? <laughs> That's the real question. Karen likes to join us too. Like white people, what do y'all play? Like, do y'all just play poker and shit like that? Like, and go fish? Do y'all play spades? I'm curious. <laughs> Fun I'm looking fact. at this place. I see that Karen really wanted to get away from it all. Fun fact about me. <laughs> Literally. I... Did you teach me how to play Go Fish? Yeah. I still don't think I... I don't even remember the rules to Go Fish. Like, probably the easiest card game on the planet. I can't fucking play it. But I'll play the fuck out of I space. hope the UFOs are listening. <clears throat> yeah. I whooped some button spades. We. I... Together, as a team. Yeah, I. So you play spades by yourself? Bet. I'm just saying it doesn't matter. Uh, well, I mean, it matters. But if I have a good partner, I can pretty much beat anybody. Bro, my man Daniel drawing with the one piece proportions. Look at this kid's arms. Hey, your Captain Spirit drawing was awesome. Oh, shit. That's Chris. <laughs> I just realized that. <laughs> he drew a picture of Chris. Wish I could show it yeah. to Chris. He should have drew the clown cape on. Visit us down in Puerto Lobos. Should put clown hat on his head too. <laughs> um. Doubt it. I doubt it, Daniel. I mean, we need to settle in first, okay? I know, I know. Morning, I Sean. Can't wait for us to hang out again. Morning, guys. Hey, what's up? Morning, Sean. Join us. Have a seat. Hey, just in time for our special desert brew. And dust free. Thanks. So much. Sean, it's too early to be so awake. Thanks for this. No sub, kidding. The black Tashi. Hey, how was your sleepover in the canyon? <sighs> Amazing. We watched the sunrise. Daniel loved it too. That's my favorite view out here. It's like ancient times, but it never gets old. Unlike us, darling. Thanks for the dono, Jakir. I can you'll be here long you after we're gone. To the Donda Hope you album looked up. Live. We did. Thanks for hooking yeah. us up. So the stream could be forever. <laughs> Anytime. <left. laughs> Even my daughter Becky loves to stargaze when she visits us. That's the only way to get Arthur to camp now. And Jack, I'm trash is the real chess. astronomer in the family. Wonder where she got Chris. this. I just thought that, From her mom, like, probably. Hope you guys get like, to meet Becky. He was like duck on The Walking Dead. Does she come visiting often? <sighs> Not as much as I'd want. Can't really blame her. But you know, well, some parts of the year, this place is full of friends and family. Christmas, for example. That's cool. You never get fucking bored out here in the desert, so, bro? So... Don't you ever get <laughs> bored? <laughs> Being out here is a big <laughs> change. We do like sometimes. That. We're in a <laughs> desert. I miss the parks, cafes, shopping. But this place is something else. And we feel safe out here. If you could have seen me as a family man a few years ago, I had everything but nothing. Now I have nothing but everything. So all these people just abandoned their, their lives Clearly. and everybody they knew and just came After out here we got to live together, in the sand. We both had serious breakdowns. Then we got the hell out of the Bay Area for the better. I hear that. I'm just so like, fucking yeah, tired of running. 
I hope Everybody me and Daniel find hearing. our own all just, like, meet up here. away. You will. People come here to reset their life, become the person they want to be, or used to be. You're smart. You'll figure out your next direction. Right, Gramps? Speak for yourself, Grandpa. My body might be 59, but I'm 25. He's 59? <laughs> Bruh. Uh-huh. I'll remember that on the next hike. I'm gonna see what Daniel's up to. Thanks for the desert, Brew. These two remind me of Claire and Steven. In a weird, hippie version. Look at that. Would you look I at that? I thought there was only vultures in the desert. Would you look at that? Just look at it. There's a lot going on here. Hey, Sean. What were you doing at Oscar and Stanley's place? Mind your fucking business. You're a little too young to be stalking me. Dude. Right? Um, you know what? I saw them kissing the other day. Oh, he doesn't understand. Kinda weird. He's too young. You know, it's actually normal for people in love to kiss, right? Oh, wow. I know. Like an invisible walls? Mean, they're really cute together. I hope somebody cares about me like that when I get old. But hey, artist, come by Joanne's place. We're making wild sculptures. <laughs> Hold up. I'll be over in a minute. Where's Joanne's place? I wish I knew. Sorry. I wish Daniel wasn't the only kid in town. Oh shit, there they go. But what's up, Joanne? See for yourself. Man, check this out. Okay, Daniel. He really have the Let's take a little break. Got it. Out the bag. That child is something special. Yeah. I hear this one a lot. Don't worry. Mm, yeah, I bet. <laughs> But you have your own talent, Sean. Being a I'm dead puss. serious. Drawing. Just doodles. <laughs> I don't know. It's just doodles and shit. No big yeah. deal. I thought my sculptures were shit too, compared to all the dope stuff that was being done. But every artist is fucking unique, Sean. We all got something to bring to the world. So why are you all the way out here now? <laughs> Easy. I started selling my work for good money. And as soon as I did, everyone turned into smiling sharks. Listen, if you want to be an artist, you will be. <laughs> it's not always easy. But in the end, it's pretty fucking cool. Speaking of, do you mind giving me a hand here? Oh, uh, I don't know if I can. <laughs> yes, you can. I just need your input, okay? Oh God, what do you want? <sighs> okay, sure, <laughs> why not? Ah, there you go. Now, go stand over there. Daniel, you ready to start again? Oh, yes, hold on. Would you put that in the house? That's a nice sculpture. You so don't like that? For my next trip, I just I'd love to house. see if you can connect these three pieces. I've made a model of what I have in mind here, but go ahead and be the artist. And we don't need a crane to lift this stuff. <laughs> Daniel can snap these together like block toys. Oh, so now you're trying to use Hell yeah. Right? Let's do this. Use them for some labor. So she wants it to look like that. Yep, that miniature version. Now, let's throw on that spider. Sweet! Where are we putting it is... Oh, no. Okay. Nope. Okay, I didn't notice what we were Maybe doing. you should keep the same bottom piece. Don't you think? Hey, nope. Nope, no, uh, let's take that spider off the pedestal. Watch this. 
he's gonna throw it right at this lady and kill her, and then we're gonna have to yeah. leave. Yeah. Sure, I'm telling you, something bad is gonna happen. The round part next after yeah. the square part. So you can use that thing over so there. So it's round this. Part. This, right? That's the. That looks this. like the base. That. That's a belly. Okay, I think that's just the. That's the round part. What in the fuck? Oh, that's a, okay. That's the, the oh. Okay, Daniel. Can you slam dunk the earth ball onto the base? Because it has what? a piece of Layer. fucking flat wood on top of it. I'm like, what the fuck am I looking at? I didn't. That over there. Yeah, well, this is the middle piece oh, right there. You should totally do like the model, but with the spider on top. Shut up. Summon the <laughs> spider queen. See. Be careful, Daniel. Don't thank want you, Drake, to get hurt. for the dono. And thank you. Yes, we really appreciate it. All right, put this shit on there. Mm. We're done. Now, ma'am, let's done. move Mr. Pancake's head onto the pedestal. Ma'am, I'm done oh, working no. for you. <laughs> this looks like garbage. <laughs> What? Bitch, I'm done. Where's the spider? I don't give a fuck. I'm done with that sculpture. It's finished. <laughs> Daniel said put the spider on top. I feel like we're almost done. Oh, well, you better be. I think this is it. Looks good to me. Only if the muse approves. Not what I had in mind, but it's still cool. <laughs> you did a great job, Inanna. Well, Sean, Daniel. I think art might be in your family DNA. There's no escape. I think we're done for the day. Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> okay. Said. You will pay 20 grand for some crap. That was like fun. <laughs> <laughs> Not Joy I. is so chill about her art. Not I either. That's what makes her talented. All right. I bet you would like Minecraft. It's kind of like. Chewan can throw a total rager out here, <laughs> but without asshole too. neighbors. I, I bet she can, cause somebody said she was thick. So I don't doubt it. Karen and Joanne spend evenings playing and chatting. <laughs> kind of like me and Lila. Back in the day. Okay, so what's the? What's the play out in this desert? What's this place is such a trip. It's kind of like a desert mirage. You think you can see it, but the closer you get, it changes. I thought the people here would be like freaks, but they're just sick of the bullshit. Now I sound like a local. That's a cute I guess I'm always gonna be a visitor. Yeah. <laughs> Super Wolf to LTS Blow Loco. Copy. Oh, I hit he kept something the name that we super came up with. cool for you to find. El Diaz Blow Loco. Will you yeah. accept this quest to find my secret treasure? 10 4. Sure. Okay. You're on it, Nano. If I can find you in a forest, I can find anything. Yes. Thanks, Sean. Listen carefully. You must find the two items that will reveal where the treasure is. Deal. So for the first item is near the place with many wings that cannot fly. That's, that's it. That's yeah. your two? You can do it, big brother. <laughs> this is a bird. And don't bother checking mom's trailer. It's outside. Love the energy out here. <laughs> you gotta help me. With everyone building stuff fly. as they please. Is it like 
Like chicken wings? Bitch, give me another clue. Yo, can you give me that last hint? Are you serious? The item is under the building that will blow you down. Under the building that will. Ow. Oh. You're warming up. That's Move wings? Up. Too far. Getting warm. Okay. Oh, man. You're right there. We found it. It's like one of Karen's fingers. He's been like pulling them Ahoy, off and matey. them. I found a map yeah. of a way. Yeah. Don't lose it because you'll need it to match up with the other part. <laughs> Got it. Now, arr, for the second item, you'll need to find something that eats the sun. Uh huh. Sure. Something that eats the hmm. sun. You're in the middle zone. Oh, you're watching me. No, you're totally frozen. What the fuck eats the sun? Not too Clouds. far. Is there like a solar panel somewhere? Getting warm. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna go for the chat in a second, and these people are still going on. <laughs> Okay. And I know. Give me another one. What was that last clue? Dude, this is not that hard. The second item is where the sun meets the earth. What the fuck does that mean? Where the Warm. Where the sun meets the earth. Warm. I need help, Shira. You're warming up. I'm looking. Middle zone. Um, if you go too far, you lose your walkie talkie signal. Now you're totally frozen, bro. Go back to where you towards the people. That's when you were getting warm, dude. You're a snowman. Go back towards the people. It was over here. A plant eats the sun, yes, right? It does. As cold as ever. Okay, nice. Get off, Sean. Hey, fuck you, you little shit. Nope. Playing these stupid as ass games, ever. bro. Daniel, copy. I'm gonna feel real dumb when Give he tells me a clue. Come on. This is so easy. I've hidden the item in a place that loves the sun. Oh, I see. Warm. Barbecue? Yeah, barbecue? Okay, go back. You're in the middle zone. I know, and then when I was over here, he was. You're a snowman. Way cold. No. Bruh. Nope. This part of town is dead this time of year. Bro, I'm about to go. I should stay around here. Cactus? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Getting closer. Now you're totally frozen. Go, go back. Bro. Is it one of these plants? No, but it's weird. Like he tells me I'm getting closer in like three different random ass areas. You're way out there. It said sun drying over there. No, that's just the getting closer. But then he says you're cold here. That's what I'm saying. That's why I'm confused. Mm -hmm. You're in the middle zone. It's not that warm. big plant right there. Okay. Hang on. Getting warm. Okay, so it's this way. So all the plants together, the crops, the crops. Oh wait. 
Nigga, how am I in the middle zone? Oh, they are, there are solar panels. It was okay. like I said. Just grab it! You're here! Where is it? Oh, there we go. Uh, it burns! It was literally my first guess. I said, what are there, solar panels somewhere? And I just didn't know where they fuck they were, because everywhere I go, you say you're in the middle zone. Found it. Nice. It say solar panels. And it's a... Tracing paper sheet with a red cross. Yeah. Oh, holy matey. Uh, okay. Oh, the windmill. It's like over whatever it is in that. I think I have the place. whole treasure map. That's a cool ass map you drew, dude. Thanks. Chris told me everything about treasure hunting. Wait. Joanne picks up all kinds okay. of scraps it's from over the desert. Here. I know that much. <laughs> she even found a boat once. Um, what the fuck? Clue? There is no clue, it's just the map Not of the treasure. Far. Oh, here it is. Sure, this is some bullshit. Ooh, looks like something's buried here. Is it a key? Yes, I think I have found the hidden treasure. A sun charm? We need, he I needs more friends here. Looks like gold, right? Um, I'm not a prospector, but it looks like the real deal. Oh, that's why he said he feels bad. There's no you other kids his age to yeah. play. You gotta play with this real nigga. Gotcha. We'll help her out with the groceries. Where is she? Where is she? Like what the fuck, Daniel? Where's mom? She left again. I hear it. Yes. Oh, there she goes. It's here. What if she was just pulling up and then just. And then the car just. Yeah. <laughs> Like somebody's just out there looking for us. You, you, the feds is looking for us, Shira. Watch out! <laughs> I thought I, I thought I got hit. Oh, but it did put me in a cutscene. I did. I thought I got hit, bro. Gotta empty that truck. No matter what happened before. Hey, what the fuck is wrong with you? Counts. Glad to see you survived the night in the desert. Hey, good morning. <laughs> Howdy, Sean. Hey, what's up? How was the town trip? <laughs> Hate these trips. Uh, people look at us as if we're aliens. Here come the sand people. <laughs> Are they fucking serious? Are they serious? Sure, that's David's character model from the last game, and they just threw a fucking ponytail and a beard on him. The deserters sure. have returned with offerings from Das Kapital. Yes, sir. <laughs> <sighs> That's literally you. him. Next time you're coming with us. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> yes, Lisa, Looking good. What's your secret? 
defying death on a daily basis. Is that for us? And hydrating. <laughs> oh, right. Can't forget your goodies. Hey, Bruh, thanks, Angel. I'm so mad. Here. Ah, you're the man, Karen. Thanks Catch you later. On, Take care. I'm s Hey. So, how did you guys like your night in the canyon? Ah, oh, amazing. <sighs> it was amazing. So many stars. And so quiet. Good call, Karen. I knew you'd like it, Stargazer. Glad mm -hmm. you got to see that. Hi, Mom. How was the town? Town life yeah, always buddy, sucks. Buddy. <laughs> but we got something for you. Oh, wait. Think fast. Whoa, yes. Sure. <laughs> Thanks, David. What? It is David. What? Wait, what? what? It's him. <laughs> It just. <laughs> so he left? Uh, or this is before? It just. Met. What? This is probably before he met. Sure, um, this is after the events of Arcadia oh Bay. Yeah, it is. It is after the events. Oh, well, I guess God. he freaking left. Okay, I'm trying. Oh, no, they said that's David's brother, Logan. What? Sure, it literally said David. The subtitle said David was speaking. Don't listen to them. Yeah, see that that's David. It's actually David. So what he left um Chloe's mom? He was married to Chloe's mom. So he decided the family life wasn't for him either. He left. He just got out of town. What? Bro, hang on. <laughs> you want to play catch, Danny boy? Totally. I need to I, okay, Me I need a good ass explanation for this. No, but I'm David's way twin better now. David. Okay. Don't listen to the chat. They're they're fucking with you. No matter what he's been through, he just wants to be a kid <laughs> and play. Yep. Daniel hasn't been like this in forever. You've all been a good influence on him. About time you boys went camping. Hope Daniel didn't get scared by all the critters. <laughs> nah. Been a while since Daniel's been afraid of animals or anything. He knows he's the bigger threat. You're right. And he does like to show off. Maybe too much. What the fuck is going you boys on here? have been here over a month. And I still can't get over Daniel's... <sighs> skills. <sighs> Me neither. But I never playing? figured it out, so I don't try anymore. That kind of power is dangerous, Sean. He's a walking weapon. He Never met him. someone with a superpower before. I yeah, tried you to be sure a about that? Influence. Thank you for the donor. That was always account. easy, but he listens to me. Maybe okay, I bet. fucked him up more. Listen, raising a kid is the toughest job in the world. Trust me. Combat was easier. Yeah, that's him. Combat was easier. You're married. Oh. You didn't tell me you were married. I uh, used to be. We're divorced now. Yeah, he divorced. Her daughter's Chloe's death mom. left her heart broken. Same oh, yeah, for me. Clap Chloe. We just killed Chloe, yeah. Couldn't put our pieces back together after what happened. I'm sorry, David. Yeah, the worst thing is, I never had the chance to do the right thing for my stepdaughter before she died. We were like oil and water. And she was always starting shit. Guess that's hard for a kid to get a new father. Especially one like me. I just had no clue how to deal with her. Dad. Wish I did. Anyway. Damn. You can't go back. We got you killed like eight no. times, bro. I'm sorry. Thanks for talking, David. David. Ends up here. Better start my yeah, delivery that's obvious. now. Yeah. Found some weird snacks in town. Arthur's gonna freak. <laughs> Catch you later, Sean. So how? Oh. <laughs> okay, time out. Oh my God, I'm gonna melt. That was awesome, Mom. Now I know why they don't play baseball in the desert. You throw way better than Sean. <laughs> That's cool. I'm glad we're that not they done out here connected yet. Connected this to the first game yeah, in that way. Get this food inside before it melts. No problem. That's dope, though. Yes, I immediately sir. caught on to that. That was David's character model, and I was like. I was like, did they just really reuse this guy's she character model? So That's cool. so lazy. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Joanne is so cool. Stanley's so cool. The heat is so cool. <laughs> You're okay. way too easy, bro. Whatever. Can't help it if I like Karen. <laughs> you can't just carry the just groceries, sir. Just be you, sir. I know. I'm just saying. 
You can't just carry Don't the bag. Don't get too cozy. So isn't sure, that, this isn't is that a take more like focus and concentration? I know. No. So sure, if you had telekinetic powers, you picking up a big ass bag of groceries? If Look me light. in my face and tell me that. That looks light to you. He's said, holding his bag with. I said if it's oh, light. Hey, if I gotta go help Joanne with her sculptures. <laughs> Don't let me stop you. See you later, Mom. Because it looks like bananas and bread in that other bag to me. <laughs> there's bananas, there's bread, there's like a, a cereal of, box, there's, there's no a, juice, oh, there's a me. can of beans back there. Like, okay, it's heavy. a light bag. No, no. So that's you a can, light bag. so your this brain a weird can tell you place. what's in the bag underneath all that? But well, that's what's cool about it. You know who you're talking to? Jacob's letter. My brain can tell me lots of things. That bag is light. You think they're gonna give a heavy behind bag to a little kid? <sighs> Feels like 100 degrees in that fucking trailer. 105 degrees out here. Let's look at Karen's tabs. You didn't even look at that. Had no clue there was a network of seed pirates. Wow. <laughs> Karen's a. Karen takes on some small piece works for a living. <laughs> Must Karen, be better than poetry. Karen, thanks for your poetry. last advice column. We got quite a response and a lot of hits. I know you don't want a social media footprint, but you could generate a lot of clicks with your insights. Looking forward to your next piece. She don't need to insight no one. Please make sure to send your invoice to May and June. Don't yeah. even send no invoices, giving no advice. <laughs> she will be telling parents, free yourself. Wait, what? Leave home. Yeah. Follow your own path. Hang on, real quick. Uh, okay. Whoa. That. Hey, Dad. Oh, that's a nice picture of them. That is a nice picture of them. Lila always knew how to crack me up. Is that, is that all that's on the, yeah, that's all that's on the USB? Okay. Thank you for the dono, crazy gamer. Can I get a slice of cake? <laughs> You're disgusting. I have to admit, I do miss that Pacific Northwest weather. Sometimes. Yeah, I bet. I guess his answer is. have been here over now. a month now. <laughs> what do you think of our little oasis? Ah, uh, it's too remote for it's me. It's a bit remote for me. Get the fuck out of here. I mean, we're just so far away from civilization. Hmm. Civilization is only what you make it, right? That's why people come here from all over the country for their own reasons. Not perfect, but it works. Yeah, they're gonna be deadbeats. You live as outcasts, man. Hope it's worth that. it. It's not easy to live as outcasts. Off the grid? Clearly not. Fuck all we ought to be almost self-sufficient. And it's a very lonely life. It's That's cool you miserable. found your safe space. Yeah, it is miserable. I guess. You can't escape reality. Even here. We just live slightly apart from it. I couldn't live here. Yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't live here for too long. It feels... disconnected. That's Maybe I'm too want. young. <laughs> oh, I understand. It's not a starting point. It's more a place to sit back and let go. Karen, well, I don't want to drive five hours to buy groceries. Thanks for bringing us. <laughs> right? Oh, sure. Facts. I'm glad I was able to help you. By the way, can you grab your evil little bro so we can all Somebody talk? Somebody said too remote for wanted criminals. Is everything <laughs> okay? Uh, yeah, I just thought we could spend this day together. Just the three of us. True, true, too cute noir. Big brother to Super Wolf. We need you at Karen's trailer. Copy? Sure. I mean, 10 4. Bro, imagine <laughs> you out in the desert with your other desert outcast friends, and then, like, one of y'all just falls off the roof of your camper. What do you do to their body? <laughs> Hola. You just leave Hola. It there. Yeah. Throw it over the side of a cliff somewhere. <laughs> How about a trek around the canyon today? Mm, this you sounds. Mean? Safe. Totally. They fell while walking. Let's pack then. No, because I, I seen a trailer on top of on top of um, a trailer. 
Yeah, a chair on top of Karen's trailer. <laughs> trailer. So I'm just thinking like. What if the chair fell over? Yeah, like she's getting up on the chair and just like, ah! you, and then just fall over. You transport over. the body to a cliff. You throw it. So when they find it, you say, oh, yeah, they had went for a walk. They never came back. We don't know what happened to them. And Somebody say, oh, said, we found I, them dead on the side of the cliff. I just noticed this dude got an eye patch. Where were you last episode? <laughs> wow. Oh, you probably missed the last episode. Probably. Use their corpse as fertilizer. I like that answer. No, because then when the feds roll up and they dig it, it like we got a whole body. In the I should have camped near that little hmm. creek. It was so perfect. Nah, you'll need a good night's sleep after all this. And the car's just half a mile down the path. This place makes for a pretty cool bedroom, though. Man, I'm beat. Oh, sorry. Just got one last thing to show you guys. I can't get enough of this. The fucking us. cops. She's gonna push us over the side of the cliff. <sighs> Come on, Daniel. Give me your hand. <sighs> Some fuck shit's about to happen. <laughs> Have Slow down, Mom. You. you walk too fast. More walk, less talk. Then you'll pass me up. <sighs> Guys, isn't this? Check this out. Literally the fucking path now, this we came down earlier. That's pretty. It's so big. That's what she said. And pretty. And so quiet. <laughs> Except for the birds of prey. Shh. <laughs> Listen. Serious? If we're lucky, yeah. We're literally right by the very, very edge of this thing. Oh! 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 <laughs> uh oh! I hear a wolf. Care about to shoot at us in this alleyway? Hunters out here. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. The wolf brothers aren't afraid of any hunter. You must hike all the time, Mom. There's not a lot to do, but. That's enough for me. Good thing Joanne likes to come with me. Oh, I bet she would be fun to go hiking with. Well, not when I go too fast. She's all about the journey. We usually find a good pace. Uh, <laughs> usually. Joanne is like Sean. They make art, so they stop to look at stuff. You're way more like me. Fast. Yeah, I am yeah, like you, Daniel. She ran fast from that house. So let's hurry up. <laughs> she was out oh, of there. Yeah. Okay, ma'am, what did you have to show us? That's so important. The sunset, the colors. You're not taking in the scenery? That's what she's coming to show you. <sighs> I love to come here to get away from... Yeah, you like to get away from a lot of <laughs> from things. From David. Away. <laughs> I bet. It's the best spot. <laughs> Let's sit down. This chick left her seat for sunsets. <laughs> so, hey, I do appreciate that you guys stuck around this long. But you guys have to get Thank the fuck you. out of here. No. Uh, you know, to know you better. it was good to get to know you better. See your life. This place is pretty cool. It's like Fairy Road. Yeah, but Mad nicer. Max. I got to learn about living in a desert. Hiking canyons, counting stars. <laughs> You're a natural born explorer. It's hard to believe you two are actually out here with me. I was lucky we had this chance. Just know I love both of you so much. Ma'am? I know you had it rough lately, but it'll be better when you're settled. I don't like either of those. <laughs> no, shoot. I'm not gonna tell her to come with us. Like, Karen, she made her, like, point very clear. Be honest. Do you think we'll make it to Mexico? <laughs> you made it this far. Going through hell. I hope so, Sean. You both deserve it. But... Thank you for the Donald Swift strike. I have to be upfront with both of you. What happened in Haven Point is catching up on us. Huh? What do you mean? When we were in town, nah, we, got uh, we saw some stories in the papers. 
The feds are definitely <laughs> tracking us. Smash her. right here, stupid. Is, is and they'll find us. Well, figures. This gonna last forever. So. I literally said that's what she was gonna say. Yeah, I could get the fuck out of here. This is it. He's been pulling you know. her back out. <laughs> we'll be tomorrow. Oh man. Can you hand me that bag, Sean? That's why I brought you back here. I made these for the 4th of July, but this is better. Oh, I love those things. What is that? Oh, oh. Whoa, awesome. Cool. Let's light up the sky. Yeah, we're gonna light one for each one of us because we're all going to die. Yeah. Thank you for the dono, Daryl. I'm gonna claim this because of the humming. <laughs> Facts. That makes sense. I think the lesson is not to forgive but to move forward. The game is showing that if one just holds on to anger, they'll end up old and bitter like Claire. Fifty Shades of Child Abandonment. <laughs> <You're stupid. laughs> the feds look up here they are. <laughs> <laughs> These niggas setting off flares, bro. Yeah, we over here. Come get us. Is that ice coming for them? It's fucked up. They're citizens. They are citizens. <laughs> Alright, let's see what happens. She's gonna pack us some hot mayo sandwiches for the road. Somebody said cops. We have a visual. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, let's see how this goes. I feel like this is where shit hits the fan. I'm a horrible parent, but here's some lanterns. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly bro, how I feel. This has been for eight years, bro. <laughs> yeah. I got the niggas lanterns. All right, I got a dip. The last meal. Um, <laughs> are you guys all set up to leave? No. So that's we have to leave again. Why can't everybody leave us alone? Oh, honey. Don't worry, Daniel. We'll make them leave us alone. How far is the border? Not that far. Uh, maybe a five or six hours drive. It won't be easy crossing that border. So I'm going to give you a head start on the police. Wait, how? What's your plan? Cops are after me too for what happened in Nevada. Nevada. That's so why they can catch me instead of you. Fair trade. That's bullshit, Mom. Oh wow. So Don't she's give gonna, up. She's gonna Don't. give herself up for them. Not about me right now. We need to get your asses to Puerto Lobos. Thank you. Thank you. It's the least you could do. Right. So much, Karen. I knew what I was doing when I came to Haven Point looking for your brother. I felt it was the right thing to do. 
And I feel the same today. You have to stay true to yourselves. But it's hard when somebody or something gets in the way. It can get ugly. You have to find some sort of balance. I don't know. Tad didn't raise us this way. It fucking kills me that we had to do all those things. To survive. I so didn't leave. want to become a criminal. I know. You did what you had to, to protect your brother all the way from Seattle to Arizona. And I'm sorry, you had to make hard decisions to stay safe. But sometimes, you just have no other choice. Okay, this is the last roundup. Wait, let me say bye to Joanne. All right, I'm gonna go do one last checkup on the truck before you hit it. And don't forget what we talked about. It's your life, Sean. Uh, you should go see David. He has something for you. Yeah. What does David okay. have for me? Is it a piece? It better be a piece. What do you think David's gonna give us? Mm, maybe some like a, a to go bag. Uh alright, right to Karen. Maybe like some peri non perishable items and Hey Karen. <laughs> hey Karen. Okay. <laughs> hey. Karen, I'm better with drawing than writing, but still, here it goes. We're so different, yep. We're both so different, and I get now that it's okay. <laughs> okay I was some grass. <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> You wanted freedom more than a family. So never give up on that freedom. Just lay low for a while. We'll try to reach you once we find our own freedom. Swag. Until then, take care. Sean. Oh, leave it. All right, David, what you got? <laughs> Definitely lit her up whole Eminem discharge. Okay, dude. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> Sean. Hey, Karen said you wanted to see me? Yeah, but go grab that police scanner inside first. I gotta put these new plates on the car. Sure. Come on. I'm, I'm so glad I'm that he's the only character that reappeared from the first game. Mm -hmm. Especially since he's on my damn soundboard. I feel you, David. Dear Joyce, great to get your postcard. You sure get around now. Mm. Wish I was with you like on a honeymoon. Hope you are seeing the world like you wanted. I want to see. I know our lives are so different now. I like to think, but I hope we can go up. Everything is so different now, and I hope one day we can just have a beer and shoot the shit like before. Where's her postcard? I want to see it. Oh. Must be his ex-wife. Oh. He's changed so much since this. And Is not that grass? For the, best. <laughs> the old days. Yeah. Let me not take that. Oh. That's right. I never saw David even drink a beer. Proud of you, brother. Up, up, and away. <laughs> Weird. Oh, he took that out Didn't of Chloe's room. Didn't know David room. was so punk rock. That's cool. 
He misses Chloe. Aw, oh, you little softy. Yes, sir. <laughs> Didn't think he'd be the type of guy to get yeah. custom plates. Yeah? What is going on? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> bro, what yeah. in the fuck is going on, bro? They, they got it. They got it. They'll take care of it. Yo, this go place has two him. <laughs> but I'm gonna what? miss it. <laughs> if that's your, po oh, okay. Hang on. Uh, let's see if I can just take care of this real quick because that's really fucking annoying. Wow, people are mad bored. Uh, Don't worry. Don't worry, y'all. Give, give, give them like one minute. One minute. Uh, that's so random, bro. Aggravating as hell. I'll I'll change it back in a few minutes, y'all. Or why don't you just ban the word day day, man? That's a lot of work for me to go in there and do that. Okay. Like I was trying to say, that is also her license plate number off of her car. Yes. Yes it is. That crap truck. Uh. They say YouTube chat is on grass. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, not YouTube chat, just that one person. Yeah, just that one person. <laughs> yeah. Me and David won't be sharing any playlist. Thank you for joining Apple Pie. Arthur said David could fix anything. <laughs> he hopes. Okay, let's grab this police scanner okay. and peel on out. How does this thing work? Uh, Sorry about that. Y okay. Oh, we wow. gotta search between 140 and 160. Hope you're having a lovely morning, Todd. Uh, oh, they came right back. I knew they were gonna no. come right back. It would be weird to be back on the road with Daniel after all this time in the community. What was the dono? Yeah, I missed it. Just. Uh, thanks for the dono. That one account. So how do you become a member? Um, you can just go to the main channel or one of the videos and just hit join. And um, we should find a letter from Victoria. Yeah. Well, let me let me do that first before. There's a couple ways to block it, so like I could put it on like um, subscriber chat only, where basically like you got to be a sub for a specific amount of minutes if you want to like chat. So if they want to go and sub with all those fucking dumbass accounts, they can go and do that. All right. So where can we find this letter? Thank you for joining, Spunky Sun. Oh, up there, box. What's David Somebody doing? Said with just raising the sub timer if they come back. Yeah, that's Maybe what I'm gonna do. Time. Look, look yeah, who it is, Nathan. fucking motherfucking Nate Prescott. Oh, there we go. Cans, Cans of beans. Yep. David is ready for that <laughs> apocalypse. It's the he beans. Always, he Whatever. Always got all that food. Yeah. So there's gonna be a lot of little Easter eggs in here. Not tonight, Harold. Maybe next time. Where's this? <laughs> where's the letter from? Somebody deleted. Oh. <laughs> free time. Please, free time. Please don't let the cops come looking for us out Thank here. Thank you, free. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for joining, Thank you for Black joining Meta. Meta. Speaking of Aaron, 
here. Where's the letter from Let's Victoria? Okay, before I leave, I want to find this letter. Shall we? Does anybody know where it is? Outside. Oh, okay. All right, well, let me just finish this up first. Because I'm pretty sure they're going to be like, oh, we got a visual on, on the Diaz boys. They said, I think the letter is only there if you choose to save Chloe. Oh, okay. Thank you, Daryl, for the dono. Um, yeah, somebody explained that there was like there was comics in, at the end of the first game. Testing. Testing. What is this? One, two, three. One, two, three. Mm. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. They put 140 to 160, question mark. Yeah, it's the police is in between that one. Is that all this person's going to say? One, two, three. I guess so. They're just testing When we're in Mexico, we won't have to deal with this shit anymore. Hey, Alex. Guys, do you copy? Come on. Pick up. Please. He's still, he's looking for somebody on a Alex? secret line. Was, is Alex from the first game? Is that, okay. It's the wrong channel, bro. No, I know it's the wrong channel, but that was like a little, like, okay, yeah, somebody said yes. Who was Alex again? Remind me. Wait, no. Yeah, Barry. Oh, he's letting us know what channel. But <laughs> 50 million times. Point 0.5. I'm just going to keep going. It's whatever. Doesn't sound like cops. Hoax. Go on, sir. They said Alex is the new character from True Colors. Oh, okay. So it was basically just an Easter egg for the new game. That's cool. Another hit from the backwoods on Dusty. And again. Oh, there Listening. we go. We've got reports of a Wait, 10, 10 is this it? Uh, Sam's? <sighs> now we can spy on the cops all the way to Mexico. <sighs> Thanks, David. You big rebel. Mm-hmm. Clutch. Okay, I'm with it. So this must be where all the gangster shit starts going down. She's sabotaging the car so we get caught. This nigga looking at the map like, I don't fucking know how to read this. Right? I mean, the Your same mom's car way. is all ready to roll. <laughs> Did you get the police scanner? <laughs> yep. The maps on my phone. And I found the police frequency. How about that? Good job. Now, you'll always want to know what they're up to. Do you know how to read a map like that? No. Surprises. Yeah, but nobody wants to, to read a map like that. What the but fuck? you struggle with the cloth? All right. This yeah, sure. is the fastest route. Sell it out. So you know how to Cross read a map, but you don't know how to read the cloth. Selling out, sure. Station. Good God. Now, you have to exit the main road and That's drive hilarious. through the desert for a while. So next time we go to but Japan, remember, you're in charge okay. of navigation since I can't read maps. You got all that? You were using the <laughs> 
phone, sir. Sure. And still, the phone okay. was telling you. Thanks, I know how to use the phone map. Okay. I said that Next map time we go to Japan, I'm going to give you the phone and you're in charge of getting us everywhere. No. Why? Because I don't want to. No, no. Because I don't want to. Out. No, because I'm the one that sets up where we're going. Ashura is selling out. You have to get us there. Oh, you said they, they that is fell our out hard. Sean, you have to know the police are on your ass. You only get one chance here. I'm not trying to be a dick. Just honest. I know, David. Divorce simulator flashbacks. No, Spunky son. We've been to Japan twice. Here. Have a seat. So we wouldn't get lost. I don't mean to order you around. Their railway system is pretty efficient. That happens. Yeah, it's very hard. easy. The second time we went, yes, most of the time I, I didn't even need the phone. I was suspicious when Karen showed phone. up with you two. But after watching you and your little brother for a while, I think I get what you're going through. Do you? Your experience forms you as a person. And I imagine all the shit you've seen and how it's changed you. Pretty much. Not comparing myself, but I had to go through my own hell. In war and at home. I didn't know how to deal with emotions or other people. Are you talking about your stepdaughter? Yeah. Some rich fucking kid shot her at school. Mm. Or I was supposed to protect her. Nathan. Me and her hated each other on sight. On sight? On sight. But once I lost on her, sight. everything became clear. How selfish and stupid I had been. I should have listened to Chloe. Instead of being a bully. All of my fuck-ups are crystal clear now. But I'm not gonna fuck this up. Somebody said on site should be on the soundboard. Sean. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw do that out everything there. I can to help that you get out of here. That's my duty now. But I wanna be straight up with you. Okay? They said that this is the Life is yeah. Strange one music playing. That's uh, a nice of Easter egg. I know you guys got screwed. That you think there's no other way out. And you're neck deep in trouble, all right. Neck deep. But you and Daniel and they're saying that can't the just hide in out memoriam forever. tattoo on his chest is for Chloe. Yeah, I is saw that, that how you see yourself in ten years? You're still young. I bet they'd be lenient if you step up and face the law. Yeah, bitch. <sighs> We've we come too far. We didn't now. do anything other than steal a car life. and murder people in a church. Yeah, we didn't it. murder them. My brother did. I understand. I do. I'm trying to be the adult. You're too young to be dealing with all this, and Daniel is growing up fast. Too fast. That's what I'm worried about. You made it here. So, I know you're on the right path. David got the thick legs. <laughs> oh. Uh, sorry. Joyce. I really have to take this. It's probably Joyce. Probably. Hey, Joyce. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How the fuck does he have phone service out there? Right? I can't even get phone service in my house, bro. This nigga's in the desert. <laughs> Hook me up with your phone service plan, bro. Yeah. I'm good. This thing got like he probably got cricket or some bullshit like that, and it's working out there. Metro PCS. Okay, old gal. Let's check you out one last time. Hey. Oh. Need any help? <laughs> Just checking out the levels and cleaning up the filters. The only thing Sean does beat the racist. That's true. I said the only thing he technically got in trouble for is stealing the car. 
I didn't know you were such a gearhead. Oh, Sean, this is basic car maintenance. And I may not be a pro like your father was, but I, I got some solid skills. I have to, out here. Poor, yeah, sorry. I'm the newbie. <laughs> I never really got into cars and stuff. Y'all are the bandies. Esteban was obsessed with his engines. That doesn't mean you had to be, too. Yeah. He only wanted me to find Thank my you for the way. sub, Eternal Heartache. And thank Whatever you for joining that, that one account. Wish I had more time. Listen, Esteban loved you and Daniel for exactly who you are. He would be proud that you're going back to his homeland today. Wish she was here. Wish he was here with us. It's bullshit that we get to see. Bro, Porto she got Lopes, no chest. He doesn't. Listen, we're not body shaming tonight, but yes. I know. She has <laughs> I didn't, no right. I didn't is still with you. Buddy, yes. <laughs> That's like invalidated the first half of your. From. <laughs> so like, I don't know anything but... about Mexico. Yes. It's scary. Sean, you're carrying the weight of two people on your shoulders now. It's okay to be nervous. <laughs> I'm just tired of running, how it's done. <laughs> of causing trouble everywhere we go. Daniel's power is overwhelming, and we don't know where it comes from. But you do know your brother. You'll be there for each other. Uh, I just want this over. I just want to get this shit yeah, over let's with. Let's get to Puerto Lobos, bro. So we can start over, if we can. Your brother sure isn't a little kid anymore. We're gonna get over and take two he shots at tequila. That's what we're gonna do. As soon as we make it over there. You're gonna have to learn to trust him and let go. Even if that scares you sometimes. Karen, it's not a real one. It was made for the streets. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. You'll figure it out like you always do. Okay. Better get back to my tune up. All right. I'll make one last round before leaving. Hi, Sean. Hey, guys. Swing by our place before you leave. What are you? I I'm came by here. to say adios. We're taking off today. No, you're not. Really? Everything okay? Yeah, just time to go. Well, shit. Here you go. Wish you and Daniel could stay longer. Do you? Too risky. Yeah, but it's too risky, especially for all of you. We all took a risk moving here. Look, we can hide you from the cops. <sighs> Not these ones. They want my ass. It's better if we leave now. Just like the chat one. Sean, I won't drag this out. Yeah, I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> Besides, you and Daniel will be back to visit, right? Nope. No way. I mean, no denying the we're going to be fugitives until forever, probably. Yes, you and your little brother are the real threat to the country. Makes me sick. <laughs> okay, I'm done babbling. I just hate goodbyes. I know you're both going to have a great life in Mexico. <laughs> you better. Uh, we... we're going to make it work. Shit, I'm gonna miss you guys. Take care. You hear? Watch out for Daniel. He needs you. <laughs> I'm laughing because every time he says like a cuss or something, he's about to cry. To the beach. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Bro, I'm not sending y'all shit. Why would I send y'all a postcard? That's dangerous. Damn. Give up, give up right. our place immediately, even though we already did told everybody on our journey we're going to Puerto Lobos. So all I got to do is Yeah, one I think person. they're like I going to the time to hit the high Puerto Lobos. <laughs> hey, what's going Thanks on? For the sub. Mm, I'm funky taking a look at this baby with hindsight. So, what do you think? Somebody said they were away for like 30 minutes. <laughs>
And they still say goodbye to UTF. Cool. <laughs> I can totally tell we what you're doing. We have to say goodbye for a while. Good, that makes one of us. But I like it. Of course, you and Daniel Thanks for the did sub. inspire me. Idiot. I love it. So, it, it you guys that. leaving now? Yeah, just wanted to say goodbye. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. You're so Thank sweet. Thank you for the sub. Your brother is This so modern sweet. love. We Having appreciate you it. boys around. <laughs> yes, thank you for the sub. This the modern sweetest love. thing. This is for all your help. Really? Whoa. That's great. Uh, do I get anything? <laughs> your name is on a way bigger sculpture. For everyone to see. That's true. So I didn't Victoria's think about letter, that. She and Thanks, your David brother needed a little something to remind him of the artist inside. If she ends up there, but oh, see, our Victoria didn't end did, up okay, there. Okay, that makes sense then. Okay, one big hug. Talks and get out of here Max before we all start crying like babies. <laughs> Thank you, Joanne, for everything. Just please take care of yourself and my special apprentice. <laughs> no worries. You we always do. Hey. Is it okay if I hang out a bit longer? No. If it's okay with her. Oh, are you kidding? I need more help. So long, Sean. Don't be a stranger. <laughs> Egg milk. All this goodbye and I hear sirens coming closer. Yeah. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. I miss you so much. <laughs> All right. Oh, you can Daniel, do you copy? It's time to wrap it up. Be right there. Over. So, did you get to say goodbye to away? Yeah. Kind of sad. I know. Are we leaving yet? We have to, and I know. Come here. That's fire. She just gave y'all the whip. At least I don't gotta walk. Does she feel like she's been locked up anyway? Yeah, she she could have been. She, she could have been super trash. But like y'all gotta I'll leave. I don't know how you're gonna get to where you're going, but you it can't stay. It means so much to me that I got to see you. I know life has not been fair, but you're brave and strong. You're gonna make it to Mexico. Just watch out for your power, Daniel, and your big brother. Okay, mom. Thank you. He's crying. Did you see his eyes? They were yeah, like red. Yeah, they're puppy. Yeah, I noticed. Sean, that. this is it. Aww. Yeah, his eyes are watery too. Oh wait, what the fuck? Well, I mean, I, I guess give, we can give her a hug. She, gave, her a hug, a, she yeah. gave us a car. We can give her a hug. Thanks, mom. Oh, he called for her mom. being there. And we, we called her Karen in the letter. Hey. But she called me son. No, I don't know if she meant that it's in like son is in her child or if it's like she's Let's a Brooklyn nigga and she was just like, nah, you welcome son. In her child. This nigga just called the police. right into one of the sculptures. This hurts. Aww. Bye, everybody! And the cops pull up. <laughs> oh, man. So where's every... I'm, I'm mad we didn't see all the other people that live here. pull over, we have you surrounded. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, fuck. That section was long. Unnecessarily long. Hey, they said that shit was two <laughs> hours. Was saying goodbye, like how you say goodbye to a family reunion. <laughs> right? <laughs> Nobody ever leaves. Just 30 hours of goodbyes. But thank you for the sub, Mims. Thank you.
Alright. Yeah, just gonna drive quiet, no music, no nothing. Hey. It might be off. Is something wrong? No, I mean. Setting. Oh, you mean okay. There might We're be, almost there, okay? Been music That's the last time I have to say that. No, I don't it's care about that. Though. So what's the problem? What? What are we gonna do in Puerto Lobos? Sir? We don't know anybody. We're like strangers. How long can we live there? New home. No more running. One of those two. Yeah, what about live like kings? Yeah. Whatever. We don't know what kind of life we're gonna have there. As long as we want. We have a house there. That's what Dad wanted, and I know. So, what are we gonna do for money and stuff? Not Rob drugs. niggas. I get a job. I get a job, man. It won't be hard. You can probably go to school. Dude, I can't even speak Spanish. Oh, fuck. How can I make friends or do anything if I can't talk? I just assumed that they both knew I was I'll Spanish. I'll teach you, man. You think so? Yeah. That's cool. You I mean, fit anything in else we gotta do, we gotta we teach go. him. And we'll get to hang out, too. Um... <laughs> well, that sounds okay. That's why I said work at a bar. I guess. <sighs> Daniel... I get scared, too, you know? But we'll be... We'll be fine. Okay. I trust you. <laughs> I don't care how Daniel feels. Sean, please just roll me off the car. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, man. Control the whip, bro. You are. Hey, the five-hour drive. You gotta keep him entertained somehow. Since you know he likes to throw his little tantrums. I don't trust this fucking kid. Next thing you know, he makes a swerve off the road and hit and a kill cactus. Us both? Yeah, that's the end of the story. Oh shit! Five-hour drive. We about to pull up like skirt. Well, here's my thought process, right? Daniel can use his power and float me over the wall. And then he can use his power on himself and float himself over the While wall. While they shoot us to the sky? Not if he does it quick. Just float me over the wall, Daniel. And then float yourself over the wall. Or just float all of that us in this car over the wall. It's so big. That's what she said. Dude, it's just a giant fence. Except it won't keep us in. Oh, they raided them! Quick! Oh no! Dang. Sean! Mommy. Why would they arrest mom? Yeah, if they, if we would stay this shit lasts until Puerto Lobos. So wait, what the fuck is the plan? Unless our car breaks down in the desert. So... Uh, hey! What? Sean? Why would they build this? Well, you know, it's a border, man. Is 
there a wall like this up north? Nah, not really. So, why did they build one here? I don't know, Daniel. The wall. That sucks. Is Dad's house in Mexico going to be totally trash, or We what? actually don't know. Shit. Yeah, we don't know. I didn't think there'd be more than a barbed wire fence out here. Mm. I'm sure it is. Bro, destroy- Okay. Whatever. Oh, this to make us Mexico future this, this is a fucking plot error or something like that. Your first option is to fucking destroy this kid has telekinetic powers and lifted a tree the size of a two-story house, but he can't float you over the wall. What? Why is that the only That's a option? That's good project for us, right? I know. That's fucking. It's gonna dumb. be super easy with my power. Yeah, float you and then float the stuff in the car. Yeah. He could literally this float the, the whole fucking car. He literally could. We're at that, the end that's of America. That's true too. He could just float the whole car. Because basically, he's destroying this wall so we can get back in the car and drive the car through there. But just pick the fucking car up, kid. Listen, he'd rather just pick up a grocery. I'm car. just shit. With his powers. I didn't think there'd be more than a barbed wire fence out here. So, here we are, Daniel. Oh, now we're Mexican. The end <laughs> we're of the road. Be fugitives in Mexico too. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Take it easy. You can do it. Somebody said because he doesn't want to accidentally hurt Shauna himself, but this could hurt them too. A piece of fucking metal can fly back and hit one of them, so that's a moot point. Shinra Tensei. Dude, it's hard. And Daniel said he couldn't float himself. He did? That's what someone said. Well, I mean, if he can't float himself, then float the it's object with right. you on top of it. Take your time. There's still ways around that. Focused. This is taking way more energy and causing way more of a ruckus in my opinion. I'm with you, Daniel. Through that wall, ain't you're no right you're surrounded. Uh, He's cough of blood. Almost. Hurry up, get in the car. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just breathe. You're taking that effing time. Shh. Breathe. <laughs> Straight up, at this point, I would run through the wall, be on the other side already, and just use his power to bring the car forward. Mm -hmm. We did it! That way they're safe and not running back to the car and we then- We fucked that shit up. I agree. Hurry up! <laughs> this is the time to be hugging! <laughs> yes! <laughs> there we go. We got huh. Five stars like it's a GTA. Get in the car! <sighs> it's all thanks to you. It's, it's gonna be alright now. And like, they're taking way too long. You've done the hardest part. Thanks for taking me down here, Sean. Oh, my nah. Lord. We did it together, man. Go! Let's go back to the car. Oh, man. Oh, I cannot wait to go swimming in the ocean. Nigga. <laughs> Same scenery. Different country. All right, nigga, you better fuck. No, you got. You just told him you're going back to the car. Hurry up. How long the park to Lobos? Only a couple of hours. Ba -ba 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 -ba. You know what? You can ask that question. <laughs> 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 okay. 
Okay. Well, and, and then I they took the ability wait. to run away from that me. That would be cool if we let's, could just walk to yeah. the beach. It's yeah, let's just happy. walk to the... Can't wait to go Why shopping. Why the car is so I'm far? Dying to get like, some why we drive up front be... to the game? Daniel. Daniel! Daniel, talk to me! <laughs> Daniel! What? Talk to me! I told you gunshots was coming. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that scared the shit no. out of me, yo. No way. Whoa. No, no. Oh. Daniel! Is he getting powers now? Like he, his, his brother got shot coming? Are these hey, fucking vigilantes? Who are you? Did you shoot my brother? Hey, uh, uh, who? Who oh! Who oh shit, Madison. I told you it was a fucking kid. Get off of me! Oh Get off of me! Well oh. Daniel! Is he? He's my brother! He's okay. Bullet just grazed Let him. Let me go! Do not move if you want to keep that arm. Comprende? Keep an eye on the wall. These fuckers blew it up so their friends can cross. Daniel! So what's the plan, huh? I bet there's a dozen more coming through. What? Right? No! She thinks We're that leaving. we opened it so Mexicans can come Mexico, into the States. I swear! Wait, wait. You're trying to break into Mexico. Yes, ma'am! You <laughs> shooting people, you funny. don't even know what the F is going on. Yeah. We're Americans! She's not gonna like that. Americans, damn it! No, it's not legal to blow up walls. That's called terrorism. You get it? We're going to Mexico. We look like terrorists to her. It's a long story. We really are trying to get out of here. You can fucking skateboard across the border 10 miles away. So tell me the plan. What? You're not cops. You can't arrest us. No, but we work with them. And they sure appreciate our help. Looks like no one's coming for now. Anyway, don't waste your energy. I bet the Border Patrol has a big plan for you, mister. Madison, come on. We have to deal with this kid. Whom you shot. Stop don't touch him. Get off. Oh, shit, sure, here they come. At least nobody was coming for a while. Yeah, don't move. Oh, oh my god. What the fuck? Why you take Get so off. effing long to... Yeah. Man, this Stop. is stupid. This is... Get dumb. it off! Bro. Ah. Jesus! What the fuck is going on? Where's Spencer? He's off duty today. Why? <laughs> Listen, uh, we have a deal, he knows. Yeah, I heard about this crap. Mm. Not happening anymore. Yep, Come on, they, they're not supposed Do to be the doing that. Says. They were working with a crooked cop. Fuck! How old is he? He's all right, officer. Don't worry. Shut it! You're both coming with me to the station. What? Are you kidding? What? They're illegals. Fuck! They're not illegals, though. What I say? Uh -oh. Uh, okay. Oh, he's gonna immediately know who we are. Uh, take a breath. Is you that... okay now? Yeah. Oh no. No. Daniel! Fuck. What? Uh, What'd oh, you say? He said oh, his name. I'm sorry, are you Sean? Oh god. Sean Diaz? No. <laughs> You're under arrest. Yep, he yelled Daniel. He <laughs> are eight. Oh my gosh. This <laughs> nigga man. The cop is a good guy though. Cause he was like, what what kind of what kind of shit is this y'all got going on? The cop's not a bad guy. He's just literally doing his job. Thank no, you for the sub. I'm not upset with the cop. I'm upset Tandination. with how this played out. Because they could have just went the F across and they sitting here playing games. Yeah. <sighs> All right. In jail? Oh, bet. Oh, there goes the people that shot your brother right over there. 
Don't look at me. Yeah, no. This no. is your effing fault, ma'am. No. no, okay. I'm ready. See. Yo soy Diego. Mi, mi esposa Carla. Y este frijolito de aquí es. Um, es Ángel. Oh, Ángela. Encantado. Eh, oh, that's easy. Soy Sean. ¿Cómo te sientes, hijo? Um, ¿Han visto un niño de 10 años? Es mi hermanito. Nos separaron uh, cerca del muro. Está herido. Lo llevaron a la enfermería. Si fuera grave, una ambulancia ya habría venido a buscarlo. Si lo dejaron aquí, quiere decir que está bien. Tranquilo, amigo. Aquí no hacen daño a los niños. Mm. That means they hurt the adults. Yeah. Yeah, because he said they don't hurt the kids here. And he's just letting it out. Oh, look at that. Yeah, fucking My Hero Vigilantes over there. Hope that Campbell's almost done with the paperwork. What the hell is wrong with well, these people? We're not coming back. Ugh. This place is fucking gross. You're gross. Bitch. Thank you for the donor so much. Cuánto tiempo. Police, you Sean? Nah, it's no. not. This is my primera vez que intentan cruzar. Me acuerdo de nuestra primera vez. Casi morimos de sed en el desierto. En realidad, queremos llegar a México. A México. No mames. Pero ¿por qué? Entonces son gringos. Sí, nacimos aquí, pero ahora tenemos que irnos. Todos estamos escapando de algo. Es la tercera vez que intentamos cruzar oh, wow. la frontera. Why? ¿Por qué necesitan cruzar tan desesperadamente? Por las mismas razones que todos. No podemos soportar la inseguridad ni la miseria. En México, la violencia tiene muchas formas. No se puede vivir así. Cuando mi hermano fue secuestrado y, y asesinado mm. por una pandilla, nos fuimos. Si hubiésemos pedido quedarnos, nos habríamos quedado en nuestro pueblo, pero queremos darle una vida, una vida mejor a nuestro hijo o hija. Los Estados Unidos no es el paraíso que esperan. En serio, I did not mucha gente viene aquí Thank you for the dono, Jenny. pensando que van a vivir el American Dream. But they treat you like crap. Pero muchos no lo logran. Sin embargo, tenemos que probar. Nosotros también merecemos un poco de esperanza. No quiero desanimarte, amigo. Pero lo de México... No va a ser fácil para ustedes. Es un país magnífico. Y me cuesta muchísimo dejarlo, pero allá va a ser muy complicado cumplir tus sueños. Ya no tengo sueños aquí. Sean, has vivido en este país toda tu vida con un padre mexicano. Y ahora los tiempos han cambiado. ¿Cómo crees que va a ser todo en el futuro? Tuve suerte que mi padre trabajaba duro, que fuimos bien integrados. Lo comprendí cuando murió, cuando me quedé solo. Lo siento mucho, hijo. Cuando eres extranjero, <sighs> tienes que trabajar aún más duro para arreglártelas. Así funciona. Oh, shit. Yeah? Enough now. It's America. Oh, my God. We gosh. speak English. Shut up, We're bitch. just talking. No, the problem is you people breaking into my country. We come here to work, not, not steal or live at your at your home. Diego, no, I am so fucking tired. Thank you for the dono again. You only come here to cause trouble. Um, and we have to pay for your Levi? welfare. You all want a free ride, and that makes me sick. This is triggering. Uh. <sighs> 
Come on. Stop causing trouble. No, no, excuse me, but I didn't blow up a fucking wall. I'm not a terrorist. We only want work and, and, and in peace. Yes, an honest job and the ability to raise our child in a safe country. That's all we're looking for. <laughs> That's what you people always say. But the facts for the speak for themselves. Your facts are just bigotry and hatred. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I hate what you did to my country. Our borders. We have a right to protect our sovereign nation, and we will. Damn right, baby girl. You hunt us like, 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 like animals. I don't think I have a choice. I want the safest country for my children. See? You love your family like us. We don't go walking hundreds of miles in the desert and risking everything for no reason. We do it for our child. A mother must understand. No, you and your unborn parasite uh, have wow. nothing in common with me and my family. <laughs> what? Maddie. Oh, what you say? It's on site with this oh, shit. See? On there you go. Site. Take it easy. This is on our Diego. country. I don't want him to get away. Yeah. Solo vas a empeorar las cosas para ustedes. Tiene razón, amor. No vale nada. Uh, whether you people like it or not, we are not gonna give you a break. You're in jail too. Yeah. Loser. <laughs> he got her a loser. No, he won't. <laughs> this nigga was asleep, bro. The guard, the guard was asleep. So don't worry. Why are we stuck down here with them? You know us. We're helping you, goddammit. Hey, you have the right to remain silent. So fucking use it, okay? <laughs> All right. You. Diaz, you're up. How's <laughs> my brother? Don't worry about him. Now turn around. Hands behind your back. Wait till I get around Daniel again. Do you can hold okay. me? Do you Let's contain move. me? Uh. You're a good guy, but you're just gonna catch a stray, my guy. Oh, interrogation time. All right, sit down. Where's my brother? He's doing fine for a kid who got grazed by a bullet. Lost some blood, but he's tough. They're taking care of him at the infirmary. Like they told us where he would. You be. want coffee? Okay. Good. Be right back. Got a nice cop. Yeah, too bad he's in folded. Fuck. Great. Now I can put on a fucking show. I hope. Oh, shit. Is it Shit. morning already? Shit. I haven't seen Daniel since yesterday. Oh, wait. I can break the handcuffs? How am I gonna get myself out of this mess? This literally Maybe makes no sense. Maybe next time it won't take so long to go through the effing um, gate. No point in getting these off. Yeah. There are cops everywhere. Yep, just wait. Well, good job then. You went to jail and So tired of all this shit. When will we get a break? I guess we gotta break it. Thank you for the dono, Jose. Do I have to try and break it? Yeah, I don't, I don't think there's anything else going on. Or maybe wait. Because it sounds like he's coming back yeah. now with the coffee. Okay, yeah. There you go. Looks like you need it. Thanks. All right. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. 
Damn. Throw it in his face. Seriously. Ah! And then try to escape yeah. that way. Coffee. Coffee's gonna make me feel Shit. so much better. Yeah, dude. Drink some more. I guess you gotta drink some more. <sighs> Jeez. That's quite a crime spree. Crime spree. It's hard to believe what it kids can do nowadays. It was a spree of crime. <laughs> Killing that officer in Seattle. We did not kill him. Assaulting a gas station clerk. We did we do that. But it was self-defense. Caught in a, another weird explosion at a pot farm in California. That was... Then uh, you join a religious commune in Nevada, and its leader is found dead short after. Yeah, it was hmm. And Man, this shit looks really bad. We're not even halfway down the list. One of those things you could get away with. But not all that. I can explain. It sounds crazy, but I can explain. Explain it to Agent Flores. Oh, fuck. She's on her way now. I don't want to talk Dad, to her. She she's spoke the to your worst. mother, who took responsibility for the church fire. Well, if she That's took responsibility for it, then she wants to defend true. us. I don't know. Whatever you think. Fuck. Fuck. Uh. She says a lot. Yeah, she's trying she to protect us. She says a lot. Who cares? You don't have any proof. But sure. Throw another innocent in jail. I don't really care. <laughs> I bet she'd be happy to hear that. Listen, I feel sorry for you. I really do. But denying what you did will only make things worse. Wasn't my fault. It wasn't my fault. All I did was try to survive. Yeah. I guess you did. You know, I read the report. I don't like how this is you claim out. that Officer Matthew's death was an accident. So why didn't you wait for the police? Because you guys wouldn't believe it? Yeah. Yep. No one would have believed what happened. We didn't either. Well, it's too late now. Your case is filled to the brim with evidence. Good news is... Your brother's too young to be prosecuted. He'll end up with your grandparents, if they want him. But you're facing a shitload of years between bars. Mm. At least he'll get a life. Oh, Daniel. You motherfucking thought, bitch! What's up? Uh, what I don't get is how two kids can destroy so much stuff. Yeah, you want to find out? I mean... Anywhere you went, something blew up. Seriously. How? Fuck around and find out, officer. Yeah, we're super villains. Uh, definitely square. <laughs> but hang on. He already doesn't believe what we're saying, so why don't we just be sarcastic about it? Yeah, we're fucking super villains. Okay, you pick. Nope, no, no, cause you, nope. cause no, no, because you, because no, lean forward. I'm fine with honestly either option. This one's tough. I don't like either answer, so just pick one. What do you want me to say? We're super villains. We can't help but destroy shit. Yeah, right. Uh, I, I bet the judge will love this. Maybe. He'll give you special treatment. Whoa! What is that? Uh, sir? I don't think you should... Keep your ass in that seat. Oh, ho, ho, ho! He's dead. Let's go! You okay? How do you feel? I'm okay. Just a little headache. Dude, who cares? I took care of the others as well. Let's go. Yeah. I took care of the others as well. It's time to go. 
It's too late. It's time to go. Hey, you know what? We we might as well just 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 go on ahead and just go full on with it then. If that if that's where we at. This guy is really putting on a freaking ski mask. That's right. I'm putting on a damn ski mask. Because it's villain time. So ridiculous. If that if that's what it is, then it is what it is. Let's go. We can't do nothing about this now. Sean, who are these people? Well, shall we try to make peace with these morons? Well, Carla and Diego. They well, came all the way from the Mexico. Other two out. And God, throw me in jail. It's not giving me the option. For it might. The others. They're the ones who try to shoot you. Really? Yeah, he's gonna take care of them right now. Bet they deserve a lesson. <laughs> sure. Three, yeah. Hold there on. Go. We're gonna get you out. Mm. Mm. Daniel? No. Wow. Oh, we could just leave them back in there. Gracias. Muchas gracias. And then they can watch us walk out of here. It's better me aquí until I check this out. Oh, of course. Oh, holy mother son, how'd you do that? Should we do How? something? Well, time for payback. Yeah. What do you want now? Your turn, Daniel. Fuck off. Don't mess with this kid. I mean it. Oh, oh shit, this meal. Thank you for the dono, Swift Strike. Thank you for the dome, That's dono, what Omar. Is new. Ah, that's what he gets. He's up for the count. Yep. Okay, oh, hands up. Shit. Don't move. Don't shoot. Hands up. Do not move. Wait, Sean. Stay back, Daniel. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Let's go. Let me think. Sean, what do I do? Quick. Oh, no. I gotta find something to stop them. The chair. What the oh. fuck? Get rid of them. No. Oh. Crush them. Now. Got it. Okay, stop. Oh, no. I said. Oh. 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 Ah. Idiots. We should have known better. Yeah. You saved our asses. Sean, <laughs> I think our things are in there. Step back. Yeah. Nice. Don't move. I'll be right back. Uh, okay, but be quick. Vigilance. Bet it belongs bad. to one of these trigger happy people. Can we like we need to find our bag? Pretty good memory from a pretty bad place. After this, you're not gonna hunt shit anymore. What if I like take the gun and it turns into an FPS and I can just gun everybody down? Well, every, oh, Bet it belongs to one of the happy people. Yeah, when I looked really at the bag, it gave me the option to for put the pin. so much effort into this. Look at that. Crime Central. Come on, Sean. We gotta go. We, gotta get here. we would be so dead if we didn't have Daniel's power. If... <laughs> yes, y'all would. <laughs> Thanks for the dono, Joking Fox. Take it out, Daniel. Que Dios los bendiga. Okay. That's right. Go. May no. God bless us both. They get lit up immediately after leaving the building. Let's roll, Daniel. That we can even give them a ride. <laughs> we can give them a ride in the Drive. <laughs> no, give them a ride where? We're going to Mexico. They're going oh, into yeah, America. They're trying to stay. Thank you for the dono. Why it matters. <laughs> Everything. Full berserk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
No, nobody is chasing us. Not yet. Emergency! This is an all-point bulletin for every unit in the area. Multiple prisoners, two adults, and two teenagers have escaped from the El Rey police station. They are considered armed and dangerous. Repeat. Yeah, we have arms and we're dangerous. Our the two adults we are armed and dangerous. Yeah, the Mexico? pregnant woman. No, he said they're considered to yeah. be armed and dangerous. Just in we general. We got nowhere else to go. Because they don't know what's happening. They don't know that we're super villains. But I'm saying they grouped y'all all in the same yeah. category. Mm -hmm. Sean, it's the 4th of July. Our... Independence Day. First one without dad. Aww. Oh. You're right. Remember how he was so in the fireworks every year? He always made Ooh. us go to the early. Don't know <laughs> Welcome to, to Injustice. <laughs> I know. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. He is so corny. He said he was proud to live in this country. Let's do it. Thank you, Hazard of Duke. Duke for the dono. But why would these niggas pull up to the fucking gate? Sean. What? We can't let them get us. Bro. Sean. Sean Diaz. Why would you not drive back Over. to the hole? Don't Isn't that the hole? No, turn. that's the front it? gate. Oh, no, Sean. Oh, yeah. I don't know why they would do that. Wave your hand above your head. Nope. It's too late. Do exactly what I say. Don't. You know that day in Seattle, the day Dad was shot, I think about it every day, uh, and I would give anything to change what happened, but I can't. I'm sorry for my mistakes. I tried my best. I swear. Sean. But you were the one with the real power, and you know how to use it now. Thank you for the Donald John. Kid anymore. Sean lost every surrender. fight. He's not making it in jail. Facts, bro. We're not going to jail, bro. Stadium. We're not built for that. And if that happens, promise me that you will be strong. Be brave. Be a fighter, Inano. Like so you brave. Are. Don't say that. Yo. Let's just get out of here. Daniel, crumple Please. all these niggas shit. Don't make any more mistakes. Whatever happens, always remember. Yeah, we're not that you're Daniel Diaz. This is it. The final oh, decision. Sure. Oh, ah, fucking violence. Let's go. Give me the option. Ah, we're going across this border. Let's go. They make it to the other side. Be careful.
Get him! Get him! Fuck him up! Fuck him up! Let's go! What the fuck? Oh no. Uh, 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 shoot! Shoot! No! 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 Okay, you blocked the bullets. Good. Yeah, what happens when you run out of ammo? There we go. Yeah. Go! Let's go! Block all that shit. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, Flores? Yeah, shut that shit up. What's up? No, don't turn your back. No! Oh, that's cops behind. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah! Open the gates. We move. Daniel's at that thing. Yes, Let's bro. Go. Beast mode, baby. Let's go. Through the gate. Get in the car. He's about to get shot. Yep, he sure is. Uh, it's fine. At, at least Sean will make it. No, it's not. It's not at least fine. Sean will make it. I need. I want both of them to get across. He just did all the work. <laughs> he did it for family, though. We can go now. Oh, Sean's gonna get clapped. Yeah. Let's go home. Okay. No. Okay. Oof. Yeah. <laughs> just, the one cop just, just shooting at the fucking car. What's up? Yeah, folded. Y'all gave us no choice. They literally gave us no choice. I'm not going to jail. Sean can't yeah, fight. I would definitely not have surrendered. Are we still not across yet? Okay. Come on. Thanks for the dono, that one account. Hey, let's go. We made it. Yeah. We made it. Let's go. Yeah, it had to be done. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. We made it. We both still alive. It's family. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all doubting me? Me, man? That's right. Drop them W's in the chat. That's what I'm talking about. Thank Somebody you. Somebody donated. Thanks for the donut. Thank Darryl. you. Too many streamers and tubers choose to surrender even Berlin. I'm glad y'all chose one of the two actual good endings. Oh, shit. Yeah, no. They would have clapped us. I'm a hype. Nah, man. That we, was not happening. Nah. After all that, like, to surrender in the end? No. No. And nobody was going to believe that story. Like. It li okay. Like, it literally, literally didn't have a choice. It literally didn't make no sense. All this bad stuff happened. You have no way to prove your innocence. Like, and then like, what? Would, okay, what would have happened if? Oh, I can explain. My brother has superpowers. Then what happens to Daniel? They would have clapped him. Like they would. He, he would. They would have experimented, experimented on him, on him. Or, or whatever. There's no good way. There's for that no to good end. way to, for any of that to go. So we chose violence. Yep. The vigilantes got folded. The cops got folded. What's this? The fox. Oh, that's brothers. dope. The wolf, the wolf brothers. brothers. That's dope. That's I mean. dope. Yo! They said you would have got clapped if you surrendered. <laughs> wow, yeah. 
wait, what did we end up doing in Mexico? Are we are we like villains in Mexico? I think so. That's dope. Local gang hideout raided by another gang, two casualties. Diaz repair shop. Oh wow, they opened up a they opened up a car repair shop. A, a money laundering business. Well, most likely, yeah. They're... Thanks for the don't know why it matters. <laughs> for one second, Roshi was okay with Daniel no, dying. I didn't want him to die. Hey, bro. Sean, Sean needed a W. He took L's for five straight. Wait, six years after, he took L's for five straight episodes. This is literally fucking Fast and Furious. <laughs> they're gonna have a fucking barbecue and just yeah, hanging out. And they're gonna leave. They're gonna have an empty chair for their dad. What a Corona. Should be in his early 20s. Yeah. Oh, the oh. drip. He had that glow up. Oh, oh no. Wait, what? Daniel, can you flatten him? Level him. Oh, the glass eye. The glass eye. What's up, bitch? What's up? What's Those up? Whole drug lords. That's why they pulled up on us like that. What's up? What's up? I love it. I love it. What you gonna do, fam? Yeah, you must not heard about me. El Diablo Loco. I'm gonna leave. That's right. Pick up your ball and go home, dog. Look at the wolf on his shirt. Yep, that's dope. Oh, now I got the strap. <laughs> he should have went out there and just started busting at them like. Yeah, see, we're laundering money through the auto shop. Thank you for the dono joking, Fox. We'll see how long the the other um the other endings are. Shira, I literally said I called it. They're gonna drink beer. Oh Barbecue. my god, this Fast and Furious ass ending. I'm, I'm dead. I literally said this was gonna happen. Oh, we didn't oh wow, that's nice. Yeah. That's a lot better than being in jail, getting beat up every day. If oh, you're yeah, no, we weren't surrendering. That wasn't happening. We're the got money now. They got money now. Badass. Yep. Badass. Darth Daniel, would you like to board the Death Star? Yo, this is so chill. 
all that bullshit that they went through. Look at that. Yo. made me like this this one more than the first like because how everything of, wrapped up yeah like, like the ending on this one is definitely better than the ending on the first game so after we go over the choices uh, i'm gonna give like my full i'm gonna give you like my full thoughts like now that i'm done with the game i'll give you my full thoughts in comparisons of the two games and how i actually feel about life is strange one versus life is strange two because it may not be what you think. But that was a fire ending. Y'all was throwing dirt on my name and everything. Y'all like, oh, every episode y'all was in here like, oh, Roshi finna get the L ending. Give Shiro the controller. And guess what happened? We made it. Like I said, we was going to go to Puerto Lobos and that was going to be that. And that's where we was going to end up. No, Roshi L choice. Fuck you, man. We did it. The only choice, the only choice I literally disagreed with was just to go rob the guy, but I didn't know that you end up there robbing him anyway. So Daniel ends up there robbing him anyway. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. Like, so with that literally made no difference. Because it's like if my ended up if my ended up there. If my brother's gonna do hood rat shit, I'm gonna just do it with him. But other than that one choice, like I was fine with everything else. I'm so happy. I am so happy that that's how that ended. I was I was afraid that one of them was gonna get shot. I'm not even gonna cap. Thank you, that one account. Best ending has Sean go to jail, and second best is Sean escapes alone and Daniel lives with grandparents. Still think it's BS. They think Sean blew people up. If Sean goes to jail, how is that the best ending? I'm so confused. Yeah, Sean goes to jail and Daniel neither one of them should be in jail. Now. They didn't do I nothing. They were trying to survive. I would much rather this outcome hang on let me let me somebody said something a, a, a comment the end shit the ending yeah <laughs> getting Get old. old the endings of this game reward consistency if you're consistent until the fuck if you're Bro. consistent until the end you will not have a bad ending either if you show if you're compliant. compliant from the beginning or if you want to go to portal also in the beginning if you prove inconsistent the game gives you a bad ending. Okay, and thank you for the sub, Nesco Pie. They said Sean would have died if we surrendered. Yeah, I'm not with in that. This, in this playthrough. You, okay. can you can tell. Okay, sure. You can clearly see that this is bullshit. All the stuff that has happened. Yeah, we just attacked the police station and we're just going to surrender and be okay. No. Yeah, no. Okay, you decided to force the roadblock and Daniel accepted. Okay. Wow. Oh, so we, it was good that we built that rapport with him. Cause remember when he's like, okay, I'll listen to you from now on. Mm -hmm. Like, cause he could have. Hang on. That one account. Thank you for don't know. Daniel grows up to be a better person. If Sean goes to jail. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> so wow. Look but, at this shit. But no, like what I was saying is, it's a good thing that we had that relationship with him that we had that we that we um, changed that dominant role because mm -hmm. like look we could have told him to go and he could have said no yeah and then we would have got clapped. That's funny. Thirty three percent of people decided to surrender to the police, and Daniel accepted, and the other eight percent wanted to surrender. So some people was going hard in the paint, being thugs until the last minute. They're like. Man, I can't do it. <laughs> and then Daniel was like, no. We've been to take him out. <laughs> Overall, you taught Daniel to put himself and his brother first. Facts. That's what I wanted. <laughs> Overall, you taught Daniel to do his best to follow the rules of society. Okay, yeah, fuck all that noise. Yeah, yeah put you and your beating us up yeah, the exactly. entire game. Hang nah. on. You did the treasure hunt and found the hidden souvenir. 90% of us did that. You overall kept distances with Karen. Yes. Most people decided to get closer. No. You wanted to keep your distance because she didn't really care. You wrote a loop. You wrote a lukewarm note to Karen. 
Yeah. God, we were like the minority. Yeah. <laughs> you said farewell to Arthur and Stanley. You said farewell to Joan. Yeah, people was quick to warm up to her. She didn't, I mean. Yeah, you hugged Karen before leaving. You intervened to calm Diego in the cells once people did that. You freed the Mexican couple. Yeah. Um, you didn't ask Daniel. Yeah, most people didn't ask. No, why don't you show me the percentage of people that killed the vigilantes? That's what I want to know. What's the next them. one? What's the next one? Oh, most okay. people didn't. Oh, y'all soft, man. They literally shot your brother. You just going to let that fly? Y'all soft. You asked Daniel to kill the officers to escape the police station. Daniel was told off about the scorpion, but kept on messing with it. That was us. Because, yeah, we was being thugs the whole time. And then we were like, don't torture animals. He was like, fuck you. <laughs> and Daniel managed to set up Jones sculpture with your help. Okay. Daniel wasn't concerned about Officer Campbell. Yep. Daniel wasn't asked to free the vigilantes. What? Didn't we? Oh, okay. So I guess the vigilantes can ask you to free them. Daniel accepted to take revenge on the vigilantes. Daniel killed the officers when leaving the police station. <laughs> I tried to knock them out with a chair. And then the chair just... Went back and then the police kept crept, creeping forward. I was like, you oh. have the option to knock them out, lock them up in a closet. Daniel was forced to intervene because the officers got too close. A lot of people couldn't make a decision or couldn't figure out what to do. Yeah. But Daniel was okay to kill the officers. 12% of us. 83%. Daryl, thank you for Dono's second best ending. No cap. Best is Sean going to Mexico. I am completely fine with that. Yeah. I'm I am completely with fine with how this game ended. Thanks for playing and following Sean and Daniel on their journey. Okay. So I have some thoughts, right? That I, that I want to know if people feel the, the same way. I probably share some of those same yeah, thoughts. Yeah, Shira probably say, shares some of these um, same thoughts, right? So Life is Strange 1 and Life is Strange 2. In Life is Strange 1, I feel overall, I am going to say that Life is Strange 1 was the better game. And here is why. Here is why, right? Life is Strange 1 starts off with this. Um, it starts off with this mystery of this giant storm. You're like, oh, this is crazy. What's going on? And then they introduce you to a cast of characters, and those ca that cast of characters carries you through all five episodes so yeah, you get did, to know feel that way you so get to there. yeah you get to know all of these characters throughout the five episodes so you go you grow to care about different characters and different aspects and then on top of that there's this murder mystery going on you don't know what's going on missing person mystery all this stuff all this intrigue to keep you going and on top of the fact that you control the main character and her power so that was cool now the dialogue was cheesy and yes you know, it's kind of like at the end of the day, the decisions kind of felt like they didn't matter. But I felt like that mystery keeps you more invested and it kept the game better paced than Life is Strange 2. Life is Strange 2, every episode, there's new characters. And it's kind of like, okay, well, I know that these niggas are not going to be here by the end of the episode. So why should I care? Like in this episode, I'm not going to cap. I didn't care about any of the people that were out of way. Like I literally didn't care. The coolest thing was finding David. But other than that. They don't give me a reason to care about any of these people so it's like it just felt like i was going through the motions having to like all right let me go talk to this nigga here let me go talk to you let me go talk to you but i'm you. not invested and i think the slowest chapter was definitely Sorry. it was the third one. Oh my god like that was slow as all hell like that was not paced well at all overall and it, it's just two brothers on the run. It doesn't. It, I don't feel like it does it. With life is strange was the um, bottle hunt. That one. Yeah, that one. But that wasn't. You know, too bad. But overall, I feel like, I feel like this second game doesn't do enough to keep you like. Yeah, because like when we saw David again, we were like, and, oh, David from the first one. Like you know, like because we had rapport with him. Yeah. We had yeah. A lot of rapport so seeing David got you excited because you saw David through five episodes of the game. So it's like. Bro, David even spawned a meme on my soundboard. This game, I can't even get no memes out of it, really. It's just fucking Sean getting beat up every episode and them 
on the run and Daniel using his powers once or twice, but it's just kind of like, all right, let's see what shitty thing happens to them next time. But they both have their positives and negatives. I mean, I agree with everything you just said about as far as like the rapport with the characters, the story building, there being mystery behind everything, mm -hmm. um, not really knowing what to expect. Um, but like I said, the biggest flaw, the biggest flaw and Life is Strange 1 is nothing that you do mattered yeah. other than the Chloe decision. Yeah. Which makes at the end of the game it feel like, well, dag, it, it, none of it matters. Like, none of my decisions literally Thank you for don't veracity. Other than saving or killing Chloe. There was a morality this brotherhood game, system. You know, your, your, um, yeah, your somebody had explained that. Weight. Yeah. It, so. But, you know, over, overall, you know, I would say this is a decent yes, game. Yes, Daniel but I can't, and Chloe were both annoying. I can agree with that. This was definitely, uh, it was a decent game. I definitely put Life is Strange 1 above it. Let me give you, there's a comparison that I can make and how I felt. I was expecting more of a, I, I enjoyed the super. And I also super, think that's a, good, a what? good point too, Margie. Um, like two, we got to journey and see like different scenery. Mm -hmm. Whereas like the first one, we kind of just stayed in like the first town. So I, I do get like yeah, plus and minus I guess. there too. Like, like a change of scenery in the second game versus the first one, you're just kind of stuck in like, little town and the school see but for me it, it's like i love things that are, i love the supernatural i love mystery and stuff like that so coming off the heels of life is strange one i'm like oh okay so there's gonna be a new mystery that i gotta figure out and i didn't get that it's kind of like when i played uncharted 4 every uncharted game for the prior to that had some kind of supernatural element to it that like when i played the first uncharted and you get to the end of the game and then these are fucking monsters you're like what did this game just turn into and then you came to expect that in every uncharted and then it was always cool to find the supernatural and so see what's I'll coming next hang on, hang on so in uncharted 4 you don't get that and and that takes away from the game because you have this expectation then just ends up being this fucking bland game that and it's just like oh that was it like I, I don't know. That, I don't know if that makes any sense, but what were you saying? All I was going to literally say was I enjoyed the playthrough of the first game more. The oh. playthrough. But the second game, I enjoyed the ending more. Yeah, the ending was fire. The so ending was definitely that's fire. That's literally like my ultimate. <laughs> ending was fire. That's my ultimate, like, I can't even like, say that it wasn't. Opinion. I liked the playthrough of the first game more. But the second game, the ending was way better. See, way somebody, better. I've seen a few people say that the next Life is Strange is like a full on mystery kind of game. People are saying that they think it's going to be like a mix of one or two, of, of one and two. So I'm telling y'all right now, we are going to be playing that when it drops. Like, so y'all going to be experiencing it for the first time with us. And I think that that's going to give like an amazing experience for everybody, like us and y'all watching as well. So we won't see people in the chat spamming like L decision and. And all and all of that, you know. And I think we laughed more during the first game. Yeah, we did. Like, the dialogue was better in the second game, but I feel like that dialogue in the first game. It was more meme, so it made it. it a little bit more fun. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Especially Where for how we play games. Like, it was like serious. It was like serious and just frustrating as hell watching this little kid get beat. The Especially fuck up. being like a minority and just all the racism. Like my goodness. Well, apparently, <laughs> uh, um, Onyx Heart True Colors isn't episodic. It's in it's in chapters, but it, they're not going to be releasing it in episodes like how they did this. You get the whole game at once, but we can, we're still going to we're still going to play in, in chapters or episodes or whatever you want to call it. We're not going to play the full thing all the way through. Everybody wants us to watch the other the other endings. I know. Hang on, let me let me see how long these endings are. Because sometimes y'all be bugging. Right? You, you want us to be on here for like five hours. <laughs> It's just gonna be like fucking hour. Jesus Christ, that's forty-two minutes, y'all. Oh yeah, no. Yeah. I'm not even. I'm not even gonna hold y'all. It's it's midnight. We'll we'll watch some on our own time, but it's just not gonna be on stream. Yeah, it's not that long. Forty-two yeah. minutes. Another forty-two minutes. It'll be one a.m. <laughs> Let's see some gosh. We'll watch it on our we'll 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 definitely watch it on our own time, but just 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 not on stream. We would we would like to get some rest. We've been operating full throttle over the last three weeks. So, you know, to get through this so we can get to the next game for you guys. So um 
Um, wait, hang on. They said there's a 17 minute one, but that's still like decently lengthy. Just, oh my God. Okay, fine, fine. Fuck. <laughs> you had them bully you. <laughs> Oh God! I would have been like, nah. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, nah. It was nah. Damn it. Uh, where's my shit at? So there's a twenty-minute one. Yeah, nah. That was not happening. I think that's the only one. They said there's a twenty-minute one. Oh, okay. 20 minutes is still mad long. Hang on, let me. Cause I gotta, I gotta switch all my shit over and everything. See what y'all making me do? Yeah, y'all not gonna hold us all night. I gotta, I gotta empty the fun bags eventually. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, yeah. Mother and... What is that? Is that the right thing? Hang on, no, this is it right here. Okay. I gotta do all kinds of fucking acrobatics to get this to to go down for y'all. Because I was just playing on the damn and I said and we can skip the ending we already got. Okay, which one? What video is it? Can somebody let me know? Uh, this one? Oh, wait, all seven endings right here. Oh, there we go. Remember, you gotta leave this small where it starts like. Yeah, hang on. I'm just trying to make sure that this is. Out. Can y'all hear that? Surrender. High morale. Oh, wait, no. Okay, can y'all hear that? Okay, now y'all should be you should be able to hear it now. Sean, what are we gonna do? They said skip Chloe's part. Thanks for the dono. What's going on, world? Come on, there's no way out. Okay. Hi. I think there's Torians right here. Here? But I, I could. I get it. That's not who we are. Exactly. I'm about to fuck this kid up. We're not criminals. We're just kids. This trash. And we still have time to choose what life we want to live. You're my brother. I said, ew, of this ending already. <laughs> and I love you. Right? Like what I, I said. I love you too, Sean. It's gonna be <laughs> alright. I promise. Really? How do you know? Because we're doing the right thing. Man. Just try Fuck and remember that, what I taught you. I mean, yeah, I would have been upset. I would have felt like a waste. Only of the time. good shit. I will. I swear. Thank you for the dono, Benjamin. Oh, bro, we'll, we'll, we'll watch him. I'm I just trying to see. On your knees now. It's fine.
This sucks. Yeah, it does. I'm sorry about all this. We're gonna look after your brother. Do all the women in this game have no titties? That's my word. Is that a is that a thing? She's literally built like Karen. I haven't even okay. noticed. He's ready. Small titty Short. Itty bitty, no, itty bitty titty community. Yeah. He's gonna be Small fine. Daniel, you're not a little wolf anymore. <laughs> Never forget who you are. Never. We're gonna fart on this ending. If I would've got this ending, I would've been like, bro. This game's trash. <laughs> this is what he would've said. <laughs> <laughs> this is why you put like a can of soup. <laughs> he said that he's born in the budget. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm stupid, man. <sighs> oh, they said Claire. Yeah, Claire. <laughs> I was like, wait, who? <laughs> the grandma? Yeah. <laughs> Is that is that it? Yeah, see, he went to go be with the grandparents. He looks miserable. Oh, but he grows up to be a better person. Without yeah. His brother. The fans really consider this the best ending. And I'm like, question mark, question mark. You know why? Because a lot of people have fake morals when it comes to these video games. They play the game in the way that they wish they would react, not in the way that they would actually react. Like, this is what I think is the best decision and how people should live in the world. Everything should be butterflies and, and roses and cotton candy. Aw, oh, that's cool. He started a... Sean drew him that picture. Yeah. Oh, look at that. He graduated. Part is nice, but no. Uh, somebody said, but Captain Spirit. Oh, there's Karen again. Wait, is he the one drawing these pictures? Oh, no. And not no, no. Yeah, okay. Oh, that's nice. Wrong. So, is he drawing these pictures from like. Chat full of criminals is. and Roshi is the biggest one. <laughs> Wait, they said what? They said he is. Daniel's the one drawing the pictures? Or is it Sean from jail and sending them to him? I think Daniel. Because remember he was practice. Oh, they said he's drawing them from jail. Okay. 2033. Thanks for the dono. What's going on, world? What's going on, world? Sean Sean becomes Sasha Fierce in jail. Yeah. Oh, 15 years. Okay. After the events of the They're waiting for him to get out of jail. Is that Karen? Yeah. yeah. He gonna look rough. I don't know, man. Where's the thrill? Where's the excitement? Where's the adventure? It's just so docile. It's just. He's like a. It's like a cliche ending. Almost. He's like, a, yeah, he's like. Uh, oh my god. He's like a neutered dog. He don't use his. Dog. He don't use his powers or nothing no more. And then your brother just spent 15 years locked up. I don't fuck with this at all because I don't think he should have been locked up. Yeah, because he, did, he, he didn't really like... Like... If you play the game as a complete pacifist, you wouldn't have done anything to deserve being in prison for yeah. 15 years. Why would I want that ending? Yeah, 15 years. Getting locked up for shit you didn't do is not cool. keep that discussion. <laughs> Actually. 
actually <laughs> Thor, Sean. <laughs> it's docile because Daniel's life has been normal. Yeah, but we not normal. We got superpowers. Magneto looking at Daniel yeah, and just shaking his head. Yeah, Porto Lobo, Sean, is definitely sexier. Dark Knee Reaper. How am I a hater? It's my opinion. What a, if I think the other one looks better. Oh, he grew his hair back out. There he goes. Lumberjack Sean. Is he going to show him his powers? Is he going to use his powers again? And his glass eye is a different it's, it's color. White. It's white and black. not black. It's depressing. Depressed. He does look depressed. They was chilling on a beach in Mexico. <laughs> Our last playthrough. Yeah, look at this look shit. Look at him, all that PTSD from prison. Like, he's gonna have a rough rest of his life. That fucking sucks. He's he broken. I don't know. Obviously, everybody's not the same. People are gonna like some endings better than others, but. Yeah, that means got toe up. I like the. Yeah. I like they the ending did. better where both brothers are free. They open up the car Bobby shop. Was getting beat up. You, you don't think. You they don't open think up. Hang yeah, on. They open up the car shop under their dad's name. You know, they're doing what he used to do. proceeds to drive his car off a cliff. life but Sean can never live a normal life after being in fucking prison for 15 years yep can't get a good job yeah he can't do anything fuck his life huh thank you joking, Thanks Fox. For the dono, joking Fox I'm sorry but prison PTSD reintegrating into society and missing out on your little brother growing up without a dollar to your name is not a good ending I 100% yeah, agree with you same. I think people who consider that a good ending are only looking at it from one side of the spectrum. Oh, well, Daniel gets to live a normal life. Yeah, but On what top about of the fact both that of them? Daniel was the one that clapped the cop, not Sean. So Sean pretty much took the fall for his brother when he ran away. Like, yes, they, he was the one that decided for them to run away. But it was technically Daniel. And Daniel that is the cop. also Daniel. So, hang on, wait. Is it really fair to? To say. Oh, there's an alternate scene. Yeah. This, this, they say this is the same thing except Lila's there. Oh, shit. Yeah, we didn't even see Lila anymore. She they thought say we... if you make her your ride or die, then she'll be there. Thank you, a freaking. The fuck is this Fast and Furious ending? Do yeah, they need... said you can skip this one because okay. it's the same thing. It's just that Lila's there. Okay, here we go. Is this one the one we did? Oh no, this is the one where they surrender. Trash. Hi. I think their story ends right here. What? No. No. Daniel, come on. I'm so 
that we went all this way, all that shit for nothing. You told me we were going to Mexico. You said we're done. The end. It's not who we are. Now it's my turn to take care of us, Sean. Oh, what? this is where he, where you Nothing tell him surrender, but he says no. Brothers. Remember how that was in the percentages? Daniel! Oh, he locked the door. Oh, shit. Stop. Bro, whoa. Let's go. Shoot. Oh, I thought he was going to run him over. Bro, he's going to get a shot. Yeah, that's fire, bro. Driving that car, bitch. Because that's why I was confused the first time when he got out of the car. I was like, why would... I thought he was going to do this. That's I thought, tough. I thought he was just going to drive the car through. Sean. Without clapping everybody. Oh, no, he shot. He got shot. He got shot. He made it. Sean. Ah, that sucks. Whoa. Oh. I, I said it originally. He's gonna get a shot. That's Daniel's fault. Damn, Daniel. Yo, I would have been livid, and I would have hated his character if that happened. But that right. was dope. If Daniel would have lived, if he would have lived, that would have been tough. I thought that that's what he was gonna do when he got out the car to walk. When he was like, "Yo, let's take care of it," I thought he was gonna stay in the car and like take care of everybody from inside the car no. i didn't know he was actually gonna get out and like handle business yeah nah. that's a that's an l ending yeah that would have sucked that that's probably like worse than the other one in my opinion <laughs> what is it, bitch? yeah that is that is worse than the first one <laughs> I would have been upset if that happened to us he did all of that and then Sean gets shot and then he still ends up going to jail. Oh no, he oh no, okay, he crossed the border, so he he's just in Puerto Lobos by himself. By himself, yeah. Oh, he got the chocolate crisp on the memories. They said that's what would have happened if we surrendered on our game. He probably would have said no. Because remember how we told him to leave the scorpion alone? Oh, And then he kept messing yeah. with it anyway. That's definitely what would have happened if we would have surrendered. He would have been like, nah, and drove up. Wait, what and the then... fuck is this? Oh, what the F is? Is that? A wrestler? Is that? It looks like a wrestling belt. No, that that is a, a luchador, but... Oh, my nigga robbing Thankful. banks. He stole one million from the bank. You got Inez's number. He said, call me. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is the same picture. No, I think that's a totally separate event. Like, he ended up killing two people. Six years later. They said a thousand dollars, not a million. Oh, okay. Bright burn ending. Oh, oh wow. whoa! The real Slim Shady. Nah. Oh man, got the teardrop tatted. Nah. They said bright burn ending. So he's about to fuck somebody up. Aaron Carter head ass. Well, remember, cause like Daniel was kind of keeping him grounded. I mean, Sean, Sean was, was kind of keeping him grounded. Him grounded. 
So he has like no guidance. Man, this is worse than the first one too. Oh, the eye patch. He got his dad tattooed on his chest. Yeah, he did. The man knocking back a four loco. His goons. No, okay, they're, they're not. Coming for him. Oh, gotta handle fitness. Oh, you see the wolf on his grave? The picture? Yeah. Yeah, he literally just took that out of the sketchbook. Yeah. Y'all don't know that this nigga has powers? Nope. This guy has Those are the same dudes. Yeah. He's gonna make him shoot himself. Yeah, he's like, he's gonna make him shoot gonna himself. He's gonna be extra, extra bad yep. in this one. Yep. Ooh. Damn it, huh? He didn't do it. Yeah, no, he didn't. Well, I mean, he didn't kill nobody. Yeah, no. He basically threw him back and told him, get the fuck out of here. Don't you ever come back. Spoiler warning for what? How does the story of the Wolf Brothers end? Oh, this is the ending. Wait, is this the ending we got? They said high morality crossed the word. Um, oh, no, 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 no. We didn't have high morality. Yeah, we didn't have high morality. This is what happens if you choose to cross the border with high morality. They make it to the other side. Huh. What? You sure? Trust me, okay? They said this Just is the best ending. Get us through. Hold on tight. So I guess this is probably if you get across with high quality. Oh, I don't want to. Maybe. I'm not hurting anyone else. Sean, open fire! It's too late. They're shooting at us, Daniel. This is the only way. Thank, Thank you, you so much, Daniel. Find your lack of faith to start over. He probably doesn't get he doesn't, shot. He doesn't so kill any of them. He doesn't hurt any of the cops. He just moved their what? cars. What are you talking about? Don't turn back for me. Oh, he leaves. <gasps> no, that sucks. That sucks too. Oh, I guess because you go live as a I fugitive. I hope you'll be happy in Mexico. And then he, and then he lives a, a normal life as a child. <laughs> they just yeah. light him up on the ground. Yeah, they said Daniel gets a normal life and Sean gets freedom. Thanks for the dono, Daryl. Because remember, they said they can't try him. They can't try him because he's so young.
And so they come for him later to experiment on him. Somebody said, I forgot about this, and he got this <laughs> trash. <laughs> <laughs> So is this just a mix of the other two endings that we just watched? No, they said he's under house arrest. They said Dan just ends up with an ankle bracelet. Yeah. Can I skip forward yeah, a little bit? Yeah, they said skip the pictures because the pictures are going to be the same. Oh no, that no, that's oh. Captain Spirit. That's a different picture. Oh yeah. Bus avoids late tragedy due to miracle. This nigga out here being a a superhero. So far, I like our the ending that we got the best. Yeah, they said the reason this is the best ending is because both brothers survive and get what they wanted. Because he technically didn't really want to go to Puerto Lobos. Yeah. I could see this being the best ending. As far as a high morality. Yeah. It's probably the best high morality ending. grandma's house but he literally what did he literally become captain spirit plus they said daniel can't speak spanish so he would literally meet sean in mexico he could learn yo that sucks though for the ending where where um, he was sean himself. dies my man's in mexico with no subtitles I mean, he clearly had to learn if they was coming for him with guns. Like, yeah. they had to have been communicating some way. Damn, the play box, bro. He's probably talking to him on the phone. I got telekinesis. You think I'm letting niggas keep me on house arrest? Y'all wild. Y'all wild. Not one of y'all in this chat can tell me if you had telekinetic powers, you're gonna let somebody keep you on house arrest. What? That's what happens. They said he's younger. Your ending was 15 years. This is six. Yeah. Oh wow, they they repaired their relationship. Yeah, he's talking to his mom. Care of Mr. and Mrs. Reynolds, is that what it is? Because they're his new yeah, because they're his new guardians. His brother sending him pictures. Yeah. He's like, oh, look at my paradise, bro. It's crazy because And he has a black um glass eye. Somebody said, Roshi, you're a true criminal. I'm not the true criminal. I'm a realist. If if people had superpowers, y'all are not going to be as virtuous as you think. Yeah, you might. You may still live your life as a good person. But if something's bullshit, you're not going to let them keep you on house arrest. You're going to be like, what? Like, bro, you better take this shit off me because I'm just going to rip it off. And then y'all going to have a real problem. Like, like, you can still be a good person, but not be with the fuck shit. Ain't gonna be no, I'm secretly saving buses full no, of kids. No, they said our ending was six years too. It was the one we didn't get that was 15 years. We're the oh, one that was okay. locked up for 15 years. Okay. Ours was six years too. That's cool. He sent them sand from the beach. Yeah. Huh, too bad you're on house arrest, bro. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm on house arrest and you sending me sand from the beach? 
I wish I can go to the beach too. But I can't. But technically, after he gets that ankle monitor off, he'll still be able to go see his brother. Yeah. So I, I would see this as not a terrible ending because, like, he would still be able Rogue, to. Rogue, I didn't say everybody wants to kill and be reckless. I literally. You literally didn't listen to what I said. I said you can still be a good person, but just not be with the fuck shit. That's literally what I just said. You can rewind it and listen again. <laughs> Sir Roshi, I bleed. May I get a crumb of cake from your bakery? Sick. <laughs> That's hilarious. A lot of people theorize he's being studied by scientists. Not on house arrest. Just end. Is this this has to be the ending that I had? Of the Wolf Brothers. Low end. morality. Yeah. Damn, son. They said I don't got no morals. You know what? I'm fine with that. Slap everyone. Folded like laundry. Yeah, this is the one we just got. Mm -hmm. I fuck with our ending. Yep. What is this? My favorite endings were the one we got and the one, the one we just watched. Is this it? Okay, I think this is it, yeah. Yeah, that's the one we got. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is it. Yeah. After watching all those endings, I'm 100% fine with that I ending. like ours and the one right before. The where last they, one we just watched. The where one they where they were they, split. Where they split. I can see that being a better ending than... Why some people say that's a better ending than this. But I prefer them... Because he's, he's still young and then they were only separated for six years. So then he can still come visit him and they can still hang out and stuff. So... Rogue, I didn't... Listen, okay. He says, Rogue says, fam, I heard you. But if you don't like something, are you just going to use your power? Hang on. Fuck, where's my mouse? Yeah, mouse just disappearing. Right oh, wow, it's on the other screen. <laughs> Whatever, fuck. I can't. Where is it? <laughs> Why is it over there? <laughs> okay, he said, but if you don't like something someone says or does, you're just going to use your power on them just because? No. Again, I said, you can still be a good person, but just not be with the fuck shit. That's literally what I said. That's fuck shit. Like, I'm just not going to let you put me on house arrest. But that doesn't mean that I'm going to be a terrible person. Like, because I'm already not a bad person, and what happened to me wasn't my fault. I just randomly got powers out of nowhere, so now I got to be on house arrest? What the fuck? Like, no. I'm not with that at all. But that, that doesn't mean that I'm just going to fold them. I folded people in the context of this game just because I wanted to just be an asshole. Are you sure? Yes, I am sure, bro. But, they, but I mean, somebody had a point. They said no matter what um, morality you have, um, they basically said crossing the border is the best choice because if you choose surrender in any scenario, uh, Sean dies. So, or got locked up. Yeah. So yeah, so surrendering is not even a cool you option. You have to pick cross the border so that way either Sean goes across the border and you stay. You both go across the border. So that's why I said I was fine with the decision that we made. I am completely fine with it. I loved it. I love that ending. Yeah. And this is for the best, and I think this this matches up with my my personality perfectly. So, low morality don't mean I'm saying it's bad. I fuck with the violence. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you guys for all the support, man. You literally broke a woman's neck. Yeah, she was a piece of trash. Yeah, she was. She was. She, told she to was shoot this, literally she told you evil. To shoot us in the face. Yo, y'all would be with that. Yo, she got. She got a man in the Lord's house with the blick just busting me in my face. What? No, you gotta go. And then she's letting. And she, she would have done that to other people. She's letting the said. little girl stay sick while she goes to the doctor to get medicine. That lady had to go. <laughs> she was yeah, completely he trash. Used the capital letters. Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she said she ain't wanna. She ain't want to endure and pray to the Lord for that burning and engine down there. Eclipse, <laughs> thank you. Eclipse started. summed it up perfectly. I need to accept that this is a game and they would do maybe 50% of what happened here. Yes, like robbing the drug lord, I would have done that. If I had a little brother with powers and he didn't pay us and we was on the run and we needed money, I would go rob him. Am I going to... The lady in the church, I would have took her out too. Am I going to fold the cops in the police station? No. no. 
would I have attacked the vigilantes in the, the prison cell? Yes. Like, I it's probably, like, I wouldn't have killed them, but I would have attacked them. Yeah, but I don't think he killed them. He just threw them up against the wall. They weren't dead, though. Yeah. And when we escaped to the border, I would have just kind of moved everyone. I wouldn't have necessarily killed everybody to get across the border. <laughs> Yo, this is getting me hyped for the next game. For the next one, I am so hyped to play it. Just so that y'all can just, whatever happens, y'all just got to roll with it, bro. Y'all can't say shit. Y'all just going to be like, oh, man. Because you don't know what the fuck I is going to happen. not to mention a third of the people we met were racist. <laughs> it's, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> okay. Twerk for the W ending. Y'all, 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 y'all need help, man. <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> anyway, that's going to be it for tonight's stream. We're going to wrap it up, guys. We're going to take a, a day or two break from streaming and and figure things out and see what comes next but we definitely need a break like i said we've been going absolutely ham but thank you guys for coming to stream we appreciate each and every one of you that has come through through all these streams and had a good time with us that's all we asked for you know coming through having a good time not spamming the chat like whoever the fuck that was earlier yeah that was ridiculous but we had a good time nonetheless yep. we don't let us we got the w we ending mess up the stream yeah and yeah that's pretty much gonna be it but we are going to see you guys next time. Yep. Peace, Peace. out.